but let's play on Iron Mage. Oh well. Probably not dwarf. I'd rather keep this for Geo. I'm probably not Lizard, I'm keeping this for Pyro. So either human or elf. Probably elf. We'll keep human for the summoner. Uh, enchanter for this thing. Not dwarf because we still have to play the geo and I prefer geo to be a dwarf. As always, this is always your preference. Same as this. Tags, scholar, and something else. Scholar is the only one necessary. And we'll get rid of all of this. Uh, let's pull this up. Let's talk about the talents first, because uh, it's easier. Alright, so as always, all skilled up is going to be good, kind of good early. If you need to spread your points around, if you want your third point in February or whatever, you can pick this early, usually there's gonna be better things. Late game, if you're playing undead with some extra talents or if you have everything you need and you need more damage, you can always get all skilled up for another point in enhancement, scoundrel, whatever else you need to increase your damage. A bit dexterous and slingshot. For mages in particular, I think these two are not as important. You also kinda need Savage Shortillage, so they kinda take way less priority if you're a mage. You're still gonna use a few grenades, maybe, if you want. Maybe scrolls. So it's not it's not terrible like some other talents, but it doesn't take any priority, it's kinda one of these things, if you like it, you use it. Arrow recovery, we're not using arrows, 
bigger and better again one of these talents if you have nothing else to get you need more stats you need two more crit you get this combat kit morning person resurrection talents it's better if you stay alive if you can't avoid dying you probably need something else demon and ice king not really not really interesting duck duck goose nothing you don't really want this elemental affinity as opposed to fire as opposed to water as opposed to poison or earth it's way more difficult to get like a good lightning surface going uh, you can do it you can just get rain on everywhere and start with a uh, range attack and suddenly you can do all of your attacks for one AP but the thing is compared to all the others in the middle of combat is way trickier to get elemental affinity going so compared to all the other elements I think it's like less valuable just because it's difficult to get if you're an elf you get blood right away if you're a pyromancer it's really easy to get fire on yourself if you're a geo you can just drop your your oil or poison if you're a water mage it's really easy to get in the middle of the battle or just cast rain or just use ice fang or just do it before the fight that kind of thing still not absolutely useless it's just difficult to use and i don't consider as valuable but still can be good elemental ranger we're not a ranger we don't use arrows escapist another one is up to preference if you want to use this kind of thing i don't really see any benefit to using it so Meh. executioner and pawn as always just pick whatever you prefer. One of these, it's not absolutely necessary to use Executioner and Pong, it's just that they're probably overall the talents you can get the most value out because you know, Executioner on a character that kills is a lot of AP, and Pong on a character that wants the repositioning ability for zero AP. Or just in general to kit en uh, to kite enemies and just gang AP over them, like any of them works. Obviously, executioner much better for characters than that kill. Pong characters with elemental affinity, range characters, or rogues that have to reposition for the backstab, that kind of thing. Depends on how you want to play the character as well. Sometimes you just want to sit still and kill things. Other times you don't really mind running around so Pong can be better for a solo character I I am biased towards Pong but either one is fine and um, far out man pretty much any mage wants this at any point uh, you can get it early you can get it much later if you see that you need the talents uh, early game for something else mm thinking we either start with Pong or Far Out. Five star dinner, early game at level 8, you get it for the Blood Rose. If you're playing solo, it's really valuable. If you're playing on a party, uh, the one that gets the Blood Rose should consider getting this, this one talent. Mid game is really powerful because of the armor, evasion, uh, resistances, that kind of thing. It's really, really powerful talent. Last Cannon and Long Wolf, as always, you get it at level 1 or you don't get it. Long Wolf, obviously if you're playing on a party, it will do nothing to you. Corrigia is for auto attacks, not for magic. Hothead, this is as always the problem with mages is that you need Savage Shortilage to crit. So Hothead goes always after Savage Shortilage. Which means that it's usually or your last talent or one of the last. If you're undead, you have a couple more talents that you can point, but still. Takes a uh, low priority even then. But usually it's your last talent because there's nothing better to get and 10% crit is really good. Leech in Living Armor. 
Vitality and Armor not particularly good in this game. Mnemonic, usually if you are playing a character that uses lots of memory, Mnemonic is better than Bigger and Better. Because this is 3 points, this is 2. If you're playing Lone Wolf, Bigger and Better is 4 stats as opposed to 3, so it becomes more valuable. But in general, Mnemonic, at some point you might you might have all your important talents, Savage Shortilage, uh, one of your Executioner, Pong, plus Fur Out, and you feel like you're good to go, you need some more stats, grab Mnemonic, and you get a plus 3. Morning Person, we already said that. Opportunist, Parry Master, uh, Melee Talents. Parry Master is technically use usable with two ones, but I mean, even then it's pretty bad. Pet Pal, if this is one of your first times, or you're playing on a party, someone can afford to get this one. Picture of Health, anything vitality related, not really good. Savage Shortilage, as always, all the damage dealers that are mages are gonna need this at some point. Elegant, uh, it's questionable, like, occasionally if you really don't need anything else, you can get it early game and with 10% crit, occasionally get like a, you know, like your lucky crit in there, but it's not really good. Mid game is absolutely necessary, level 8, level 13, you should get this at any point between those two levels. If you need to switch one of the talents for this, it's worth just for the increase in damage. Slingshot we talk about, Stench is useless, even more on a solo player. Pong we talk about, Torturer doesn't really benefit an Iron Mage. Like at most, uh, Suffocating Touch maybe, maybe Deathwish if you're running with that, but you know it's like, it's like a really really niche thing. So for a Torturer, it doesn't do much for uh, Iron Mage. Unstable, not our build, walk it off. Interesting talent, not for players though. Um, Water Rush. Uh, for those who've seen the Ranger, you can see the AP game with this kind of thing, with this kind of talent. You're playing low HP, you can keep the enemies in place far away, you can keep them stunned forever. Water Rush is gonna give you so much AP because every turn is one more. And um, potentially you can save points to if you're hasted, I think you can get 13, 14 points or something like that. Plus adrenaline, plus flesh sacrifice if you're playing an elf. So really powerful, tricky to use though. If you have necro, it becomes annoying not to heal yourself and losing this. But oh well. We'll play either Pong or Fur Out. Probably Pong, not sure. That's for talents. For skill books. Alright, we are an Iron Mage. So obviously, let's look at Iron, what we got here. What's the build gonna be? Your th three range attacks. Single target shock, AoE shock, and pressure spike because it's really, really good. Alright. Single target shock, electric discharge, it's range, it shocks for two, gets all the bonuses, high ground crit if you have Savage Sword Lich. It's actually a bad multiplier, I think it's 90% or something like that. It's low damage, but it shocks at range, that's why it's good. You got a uh, Dancing Bolt, which is basically your opener. If you have nothing else like Chain Lightning or Superconductor, uh, Dancing Bolt is probably what you're gonna start fights with, other than Teleport, because it's 3 AP, shocks for one, so it can potentially stun on its own. This was a problem we had with the Hydro Mage, because it's currently bugged. Attacks that can, that used to be able to stun on their own, can no longer do it, except for Dacing Ball. Dacing Ball still works. If someone's standing on blood, someone's standing on water, you use Dacing Ball, 
you shock once, you shock twice, they get stunned. For pretty much this one, this one, chain lightning as well. Yeah, for those it no longer works because it, they shock for two. So the enemy gets shocked for two. The surface shocks for one and it doesn't shock for some reason. It's been changed. So this is still good because it can stun in its own. 3 AP, big AoE. Like pretty much all advantages. Pressure spike, it's a 1 AP 70% damage uh, skill. Again, it's range, uh, scales pretty well. And like I always say, any 1 AP attack that can kill is good, especially if it's ranged. Part of the reason why Corpse Explosion was so powerful, other than the multiplier, is because it's 1 AP and it's range. So it can get high ground, eventually crit, and it scales decently. Superconductor, 3 AP, not a super good multiplier or anything like that. But what's good about uh, Superconductor is the small AoE. It's like a tiny, tiny AoE. So if enemies are standing very close together, it can stun with song. It shocks for one, so if they're standing on water, they will get stunned anyway. But you can get like a multi-hit with this. If you have two enemies together, you're gonna cast this and hit four times, because this small AoE is gonna hit them both. We're gonna use the rain, because rain is really powerful. It also lowers uh, lightning resistances, which eventually will become a problem. And it also allows you to basically keep people in place for a long time. Like you see, it rains, sets wet once, you use any attack, stun everyone, next turn, wet again, stun everyone again. We're also gonna be looking at Adrenaline and Chloroform. Obviously Adrenaline is the most powerful skill in the game, and Chloroform is the best magic CC. 1 AP, 3 turn CD, it's ranged. Like, the only bad thing that you can say about Chloroform is that it scales with finesse, and even then you don't really care that much. Uh, note for uh, Iron Mages, electrified surfaces will wake enemies up. This is probably a bug, as it is the only surface that does it. You can put an enemy to sleep standing on poison, on fire, wherever you want, like any other of the damaging surfaces, and you still apply the sleep and they take damage. For electrified surfaces, before their turn, or when they when their turn starts, they get shocked and they wake up. Might be, might be intentional, but it's like a really weird interaction that I haven't seen anywhere else, so I'm assuming it's a bug. It's been in the game for a long time. As for everything else, let's look at Iron. Blinding Radiance, again, lower than normal multiplier. It's AoE, it's mostly melee. Not exactly melee, but you know what I mean, close range. So we might use this at the start for you know, just for having extra attacks. It applies blind, which is not the best CC. It also gives you temporarily like 20 or 40% air resistance. A few of those skills do, for some reason, but... I mean, it's not entirely useless, but it's not the best. We talk about electric discharge. Uh, Fabro Wind, just ignore this thing. It's not even good on a support. I don't know. I feel like this skill could be so much better with some other buff. But as it is on the base game, it's really weak. Shocking Touch for 2. It's a melee touch. Uh, it's higher it's higher than normal multiplier. But it cannot. it can no longer stand on its own. Which is why it's not that great. So even if they're standing on water and you shock with this, it will not stand right away. So again, it's melee, it's a touch kill. 
is not that great in this game. Teleport for obvious reasons, super powerful, it does not do lightning damage, it does not scale with lightning damage, it scales with warfare, it does scale with intelligence, but uh, I don't consider that for a, for an Iron Mage, Every it's absolutely necessary. Here. Tall and strong, join us. Like, it's still good to use, but if you're playing on a party, for example, you might as well just focus on doing damage instead of teleporting enemies. Uh, this in bold, we talk about evasion, another defensive option. I would say that I would say that for uh, Iron Mage, maybe we use this more than invisibility. Later on, we'll use invisibility. Maybe I'm not sure. Another swap again, repositioning tool. It's not absolutely necessary, it's just very powerful. Can get you out of places, can get you high ground, can help you set up for your AoE attacks. Pressure spike, we talk about this. Uh, up rotation, it's, uh, it's a bit of a meme. You don't really want to use this in combat ever. I don't think it has any applications in combat. We look at Chain Lightning on Closed Circuit, we'll use one of them, I'm not sure which one, I am more biased towards Chain Lightning because it's more classic, but uh, I mean 3 AP, 1 source, you can fork up to, it says up to X times, the problem in these games is that forking attacks or bouncing attacks sometimes get glitchy and they get blocked by nothing so occasionally you'll see me cast this and not bounce properly it just it just happens in some areas and then you get close circuit which is two ap two sources it's a strictly better version of uh blinding radiance because they do pretty much the same this one is way more powerful you see it can stun and the multiplier is much higher, obviously it's a bigger investment in memory. It's a pretty good skill, I kinda want to use it, but we'll see how it goes. They are both good, you can use either one of them, or just one. Like, Iro is that weird school where everything is, every source is pretty much useful in some sort of situation, even Thunderstorm is not that bad. Superconductor, again, we'll get this early at 12, I believe. Um, tornado is just, I mean, it it works for clearing death fog, and that's about it. I guess you can reveal invisible enemies, you can clear surfaces, you could clear necrofire, I suppose, but uh, it's 2 AP, so in the middle of combat, you don't want to waste 2 AP on this kind of thing. And Thunderstorm, 4 AP, 3 sources, a uh, big AoE though, and hits every turn. If you're delaying, you can get like a... how many hits is this? You can get 3 hits right away if your first cast stuns people. It's, uh, di it's difficult to set up, but you could potentially do it. It stuns on its own, small AoE, as well as it's bigger than... Superconductor at least. So if you set up properly, you can just hit a lot of enemy, a lot of enemies at the same time. It's an okay multiplier. It used to be much more, much more powerful and classic. But big uh, ultimates that use lots of sources are not my thing, kinda. I guess uh, other than pyroclastic, everything else is pretty bad. Mortal Blow is okay, so I don't really like using it that much, but we might do it, who knows. As for Geo, pretty much nothing from Geo is gonna help you. You could do, you could do Iro Geo Mage, it's a, it's a possibility, but uh, for Let's just say for flavor, for keeping the spirit of an Iron Mage, 
I don't think any of this is good. Like you can certainly use poison, you can certainly use this is, uh, you can certainly use these attacks, but obviously Iro works pretty well with any other school, especially with Hydro because of rain. And potentially with uh, fire because you can stun people and still burn them. So Iron Mage by itself, this is what I said when we played the Hydro. Iron Mage by itself is gonna have a big problem when you run into enemies with resistances. So that's why Iro, Iro Hydro is a thing because it goes relatively well. You can you can have a few more attacks and keep things running as opposed to using your three attacks and suddenly having nothing else to do. Another possibility is to use the three or four technically. The four necromancer attacks when you run into immunities or high resistances 80 plus which 80 plus should be manu manageable with uh, rain but still annoying to play against. Again, you can use Geo if you like, you can use Fire if you like, uh, Haste and Peace of Mind will be using because they are super powerful. I am thinking that it can, it can basically go with any skill. We're gonna talk about Hydra in particular because it's the one that goes together better so to speak. You have your three ice attacks and then rain because rain is really powerful, lowers resistances, can allow you to stun two turns in a row. I guess we should talk maybe about restoration but we don't have warfare so it's not as useful. But as always, restoration and first aid for undead enemies can be a thing that you just equip and you have a 1 AP damage attack if you actually want to target the physical armor. We'll be doing pretty much only magic damage except for teleport and if we want to swap to necro for those immune enemies. Global cooling as well, like those are your ice attacks if you wanted to play Hydro Iro. We'll be playing mostly Iro only. Occasional Occasional Necromancy, I guess. Just to just to get rid of those resistances. Necro, we have our Decaying Touch, 2 AP. It's a pretty bad spell because Decay is useless to us. So it's still there for the immunities, one more attack is good. Mosquito Swarm, a range attack, Blitz, again it's just for immunities. Uh, in fact, 3 AP, it does, uh, it does uh, disease, so you can do this at the start if they have no physical armor and lower their max HP. This 3 for immune enemies along with Corpse Explosion because they are really powerful all put together. And then we look at Death Wish and Living on the Edge. As always, if you want to run with this, Death Wish is really, really powerful. And Living on the Edge is just for when you want to do something stupid. Still not completely useless. It's just not my kind of skill. I'd rather, I'd rather use Death Wish. But you can use both either. Still fine. Nothing else for Necro. I uh, can make an argument about uh, Black Shroud, maybe. Maybe Grasp if you want one more attack for uh, for lightning immune enemies. But that's about it. This one's pretty bad, this one's useless, this one's terrible. That's it. For Poly, uh, this is physical, this is physical, and this uses your weapon, which you don't really want to be doing auto attacks with an Iron Mage. Although occasionally we might do them. Invisibility, another defensive option. As always, you just need a couple of these. Either Evasion, Entangle, uh, Shackles, Invisibility, uh, Smoke Screen. With a couple of those you should be good. Usually the easiest to use is just Invisibility, 
plus evasion that should cover you most of the game but you can use others if you like but is ahead again this is melee doesn't work as well if we stay far away but it's still uh, an option to consider because we're magic damage and medusa head by itself is really powerful some fights are trivialized because of this you cast this you already won because the enemies don't have armor on their melee um it buys you a lot of time in some situations i'm probably gonna use this i believe I'm considering it. Another CC option, spider legs. You will not, um, you will not burn enemies unless you're playing, obviously, with some pyro. So it's an option to use uh, spider legs. It's not even close to how good it used to be in classic, but it's still usable in some situations. Again, spiders in this game are immune. So just watch out for that. Um, skin graft. I mean, there's a point to be made that skin graft might not be the best in an arrow, like the best source skill because you have these two, but still really powerful. Double invisibility, double adrenaline, that kind of thing allows you to reset rain, reset dazing bolt keeping enemies in place really really powerful we'll be using this eventually nothing else interesting not even lower resistances like I always talk about this is too expensive and it doesn't work until you break the armor so if they are resistant to lightning and you're having difficulty breaking their armor when you break the armor this is not gonna help you it's just just help it's just helping you do more damage when you don't need damage by the point you don't need damage more like in summon we are actually looking at uh, totems because of water totems really really powerful when we played the hydro I really liked it so let's try to do the same here if I get the ring with summoning or something like that we can go for this straight away <laughs> There's a charm as well as an option later on. We'll see if I actually want to use this. Like 3 AP for 2 turns to CC it's okay. But 3 AP when they have walk it off or they have a way of removing this is not that great. So it's, uh, it's okay to use, not particularly good. Nothing from Huntsman other than jump and then on scoundrel another jump you pick whatever you want to use like you can see that we're already using scoundrel 1 so might as well use scoundrel 2 if you can get huntsman 2 from your gear there's no need to put up another point here and tactical retreat is technically better in combat it's just a matter of preference whichever one you use but you kind of need one of the two jumps just to move around nothing else we're not cringe we're not using daggers, although we could, we could. And then we have a warfare, which is only important because of Phoenix Dive, nothing else. Like uh, you can get warfare one for executioner, but that's about it. As for hybrids, we have uh, suffocating touch, which is good because it's a one AP, one AP skill with a high multiplier. Not high, well, I don't know if it's 80% or 85, something like that, but for 1 AP it's really good. Uh, it's obviously touch uh, skill, so melee range, so it takes away, but it also suffocates and silences, which not the best kind of CC, but occasionally it will be useful. It's just one more attack, it's 1 AP. And it's easy to get, so if we get Necro from, from a ring or armor or something like that, we'll be using this. Suffocation Aura, Vacuum Aura. Does damage when you activate this, lasts for a long time and silences. All sounds very good, it's really expensive to cast, it also requires 2 Necro. 
and it can actually hit uh, neutral enemies and you aggro them by mistake. So it uh, can be a liability using this and accidentally teleporting to Driftgood and suddenly everyone is hostile. So just be careful with that kind of thing. Still usable and I really like the concept of this skill. Really cool. Uh, we're gonna leave this for uh, for the Geo because it fits better. Corpse Explosion for uh, lightning immune enemies. Nothing else from here. Like as always you, get, you can potentially use uh, Throw Dust if you're playing Geo as well, like Geo IRO. Or you want this for the for the removing surfaces part? You can use uh, traps if you're playing with pyro, or even without pyro. Traps are really powerful if you need more attacks. But I mean, it's just you can use whatever you like. Doesn't mean it's particularly useful or it fits that well. Uh, vaporize. We're all gonna look at this because. There are, some, there are some fancy things that you can do to stun enemies with this. If you wanna cast rain first, vaporize, and then cast rain again, you can get both the steam and the and the water surface. So just hitting one of them is gonna electrify everything and instantly stun. But it's a good really convoluted thing, so maybe we don't even do it. Still, it's an interesting skill. It might not be even used this playthrough, who knows. Nothing as for the skins. I at best fire skin, but that's about it. Nothing from here. Uh smoke screen, bless smoke screen, another defensive option. Late game, you can get permanent invisibility with this if you like. Like we're using Iro and this is technically considered Iro. But even then, I don't know if I will use it. Nothing here, no infusions, we're not a summoner. Nothing here. There's a point to be made about Breathing Bubble for that one fight with Death Fog in Act 4. But even then, as long as you mind your positioning, you should be fine. And it's a pretty bad skill by itself. Anyway. What we'll be playing is some sort of uh, Iron Mage with all of these attacks, including Shocking Touch, or sorry, um, Suffocation Touch, um, maybe Totems, and then when we start running into immune enemies, we'll see what we do. Alright, that's for the skills. So what are we starting with? Like I said, we're starting with obviously Iro and something else. My talent is gonna be either Pong or Far Out. So I'm considering should we start with Scandrel? I'll get Adrenaline for free. So I think that's gonna be a yes. We start with Scandrel. I got Lord Master for free because I'm Elf, so that's nice to check resistances. Telekinesis, just so I can loot better, and then we start 3 wits because it's convenient. So we get Chloroform, we get one attack, and either one of these works. I'll get Shocking Touch, actually no, Blinding Radiance. Yeah, something like that. Talents, we just get the palm, we just check everything is in place. And obviously, uh, the loadout is only important for your initial weapon, which is why I want the lightning stuff.
So it it wasn't a dream after all. Why you're looking a bit more in the world? In blah 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 blah. We carry on. There's adrenaline there. We'll get it after they die. Grab my petrol if my character wants. Just preparing my inventory, we get a scroll here. You can get the knife, you can get the poison because they are worth some money. And one of the beers. Alright, this is gonna be two, three, four. This is probably gonna be five chain lightning, six is gonna be touch, so seven. Hit once, hit twice. It doesn't aggro for some reason. No, I'm waiting for the CD again. He might not be looking at me. Oh, there we go. I, I do it this way because I aggro the Magisters, so now when they die, I get some extra experience. Since I, I'm not playing on a party, I don't want to be level 1 when I get to Fort Joy. What? What's happened? So having the extra, the extra experience is nice, get my stuff. We'll be using this most likely. Uh, I could go for adrenaline now, we'll get it later. The dog only gives 25 experience, so it's a bit of a waste of time. Water. Now oh, we can just delay here. Unfortunate. Oh well. I don't play origin characters because they have extra quests and uh, I mean you don't need their skills like fame, time warp. Why could you use that? It's so powerful. God damn it! Need to get off this wreck and quick. I can pretty much do exactly the same with any of the origin characters. Haven't got the second one. I have. God, I need to get off this ship. That's way more range than I thought. Well, delay. You can delay and keep this. It's 20%. 40 is uh, 
Yeah, Erotic Wisp, I think. You can delay and keep this buff. Keep the enemies blinded. That's why it only lasts for one. It's not that good. Still. Still okay to use. Not undead, so I can't get this experience. It's unfortunate. It. Just going up there for the fire one. Tiny bit more money. I can wait until two and eat this in the middle of combat. I got some experience there. Nothing special here. You can let Seville kill everyone by herself. By far the most powerful character here. They who are about to triumph. Oh wait, I don't level up, never mind. I thought I was undead for some reason. We can put it to sleep. Doesn't do anything, next one. Oh well. As the dead man's your Sashi the Still hot running for free. Can't do anything until everyone lives. Yes, if I was undead, I have uh, 200 more, 300 more potentially. Those void woke made short bloody Alright, so my level shit. 2, Fibri, because early game you need Why? books, you need lots of things, survivor. and Fibri is nice. So Some we're gonna hold on to these points for a bit, Some probably don't need adrenaline, depending on what rings I get. So this kid doesn't have a ring, that's fine. It's a low chance. Sometimes I try four, five, seven times, doesn't happen. Oh well. We're gonna ignore this for now. Ah, get rid of Sir Laura.
Now this is the part where just we just walk around, get some money, get some loot. Some would see this as an omen. Open a couple waypoints. So I got my shovel. Which is a key item in this game by the way. I've spotted something. This is always the same loot. Haste, that's interesting. Grab the yarrow flower. We're gonna keep these three for a couple quests in a second. Free experience without fighting. Will not fight until three. Alright, get the waypoint, I just need to get a bit closer and get free experience here. Amidst a crowd of screws, bolts and scraps of metal, We got Hydra, okay, that's actually good. That's actually good. Fitted with five long metal skewers. Alright, I can do this. And I end up with a ring and 70 gold. Or uh, how much is this? I can't remember. Six. Or we can give her some money, give her some stuff for free. Again, buy the ring. And this time I end up with 144. Which is more than before. Because the attitude is higher. She pays me more for my stuff. And her rings are cheaper. And what you have? This is worth doing for Nebora because he's our main trader for a bit. And um, probably in Driftgood. Everyone else is kinda optional. The Seekers as well because we'll be selling a lot of stuff to them. Supplies, we go down here, grab experience, go back up. Alright, so I'll probably get Polymorph here for invisibility. Because you can't get Polymorph from rings. Faithfully busy at the moment, love. This is what the ear is for. And the comfort. And the scroll. Before she does anything. Kill this guy. You think uh, what? Uh, let me target see. Just like me, man. I can get another one, but I just want this. I get the invisibility. Is that thing eating? Cool. Might not use it until later. The creature you now. The creature, fourth the option, the yarrow flower, or you will die. What's this? I found something. More experience. I got some boots. Balloons are, I mean, not super useful, rain is way more powerful, but still, if I don't have a source of water, I can throw I a balloon. Something. And there's the first undestructible chest in the game, probably. We got Perseverance, which is, might as well be nothing, it does nothing right now, it's uh, bugged. We go from here. The shrine you... 
you need 12 wits to see that or talk to either more first. Again, just getting experience, getting some uh, loot, getting some money. Nothing in particular that I need. Skill books are nice because they're very expensive. If I had a lockpick or if I was undead, I could do this right now. I, I. Go on, speak. That's why you're here, isn't it? It, it isn't right. All right, Del. I sneak until right here. Go invisible, defined. which is why I bought that. Uh, because I am not undead and I didn't have a lockpick, I have to walk again. Otherwise, I could do this first. Am I going to kill Dalis? Probably not. Probably not. It would be too slow. I don't have like a good form of CC. Uh, we got like a physical weapon. Uh, we killed Vertas. We get some money, which is nice. But that 75 experience is gonna give me three at the right mo uh, the right time, so that's why I kill him. Muffles. Even if it's a bit out, uh, awkward going back there instead of just straight here. I've spotted something. Another one. I don't think you need wits for this. Maybe like 11 or 12. Or talk to Withermore, and he tells you that's there. Uh, we're hoping for Dazen Bolt, Teleport or something like that on this chest. It's a crossbow. Hmm, interesting. Okay, this is the real jar. We'll come back here later to fight. If I have a scroll of peace of mind, I can go there and get the pants. Holding on to buying points for a bit. I'm not sure how much memory I need. Plus, I need to see my level 3 ring well out of sight to magistrates. decide what to use. I could go invisible here and do this slightly faster. Alright, nails, hammer, because I am a living character for some reason. I need lockpicks, so hammer, nails, lockpicks. We'll keep the hammer a bit more, I need uh, about 20, is what I usually do. Get the ladder down so we can get high ground later. Open this, get level 3. The Magisters certainly don't spare exactly expenses, level 3, that's why I killed Verdus. And um, again, we're just hoping for some loot. Probably a uh, skill book on the chest outside. There's always blood rain in there. Mm, we're not gonna use it, I think. I can keep this. Nothing, okay. That's fine. Check the kid again. As long as you don't steal. You can keep checking. Nothing, still. Uh, lots of things. Nebora probably doesn't have money for this. Screws, uh, HP, that's metal. really unlucky. Is manipulating a glove -like contraption fitted with five long metal skewers. It's really unlucky. Alright, so what am I gonna do now? Hmm. 
Let's do Wither more first. Right, maybe I get lucky and I get an armor with uh, plus one to summoning, maybe. Nevora can have a rings with HP, which is whew, unfortunate. Alright, no haste, no peace of mind. I need a plus one to strength from this guy. Let's wait for this woman. She sits, now I can do this. Get this potion, get some money. Steal the kid, the kid doesn't have anything good. I found something. Kill book here. Peace of mind, a bit late. Oh well. Help. Help me. Alright, so. Please. I need 12 strength for this, so that's what the potion's for. Plus the bedroll. Uh, I've got Good. Uh, I must I thought he Good madam. You you have. What? You will not walk away from I double experience from this for some reason. You refuse to keep the jar, drop it, break it. Bam, lots of experience. You're getting that 1600 extra for some reason. Alright, let's look at this. Uh, not yet, not yet. We can keep going a bit more. Uh, probably this. I get first aid for free, which is not super useful or anything, but I'll take it. Get experience right about here. We're not gonna do the frogs yet. I've spotted something. Key okay, for the dogs later. This looks like the crate I'm after. But where right, are the I probably want this two for later, so I'll steal them now. I could steal some money as well. Finesse always works. It's an automatic success. You can have, I think it was six finesse and still succeed. Six finesse, zero persuasion. Talk to this guy. He's got uh, some nails. For your tail. Very cheap. We are so star. I see. I ah. We it is. Second option for Ruby. Mm. Right. I don't need any more lockpicks for the rest of the game. Spam one for our wrist to scroll. Keep it there. We get an invisibility potion and some other stuff. Not like I'm gonna use it, but you know. Just so he doesn't use it. Oh, let's fight this crab. If I can actually target it, it's gonna take a bit. This chest always has ring. I uh, very conveniently have a hydro ring. So now I got ring. Uh, this is uh, this is six up there. I need to kill the crocodiles. I'm not confident with this. Just three skills is 
Very few. I need like a, one more attack or something. Okay, here we go. Plus sacrifices, ideally. Ideally used before doing anything. Oh, it's first aid is in the way. I'm just gonna do this because I thought I had brain. Alright, that's some extra experience, some extra money. And I need to decide what attacks do I want. Okay, let's look at this. I'm pretty sure I'll be using Flare Out here. It's too early for this. Hothead, not really. Five star, uh, too early, I believe. Element of Affinity, yeah, all skilled up, maybe. I think we're going with Far Out, and that's it. As for my points, I got one more point here, so. Iro 2 doesn't give me any more attacks. Geodos, Pyrodas, Necrodos. Summoning gives me totems, which can be really good here, but one point in summoning is kind of... Okay, we're gonna check real quick. There's a low chance I get a... I get a skill from this. Scoundrel, okay, okay not what I hoped for. It's not even useful now, but I'll take it. Uh, I should probably pay Nebora for. Oh, Nebora, Hilda. 150 for her. I'll buy Cloak and Daga later, so I think it kind of works. Why don't you take a... Alright, talk to Griff, give the orange. Griff glances from his blade to you, Griff. Looks like everything's accounted for. At a kid. Send the assassin, we'll deal with her later. It is Blah 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 blah. I'll keep the amulet just a bit longer. Some skills are no longer valid. They were never valid in the first place. Alright, we get Rang. This is my Iro trailer. You, you there. So we can you, potentially you get Shocking right? Touch right are you, here. Are you quite alone? Uh, wanna wait until four, but let's do it. In that case, I the best He's gonna ask me to kill some crocodiles, which I am already on the process of doing. I'm just getting my skills for that. Amidst a crowd of screws, bolts, this is and very and unfortunate. The woman is manipulating a glove like contraption fitted with five. I want your... But oh well, I'll put a point in summoning right away. We get totem, and I'll get how many more skills? I need one more. Uh, yeah, one, two, one point in memory for that. Uh, we can do. One more wits. No, I'll do four int right away. It's not gonna be a big increase or anything. But I have rang off totems, which is gonna be five for now. And I can kill the crocodiles. Okay, I can kill lots of things to be fair. He hasn't changed a bit. Mommy's right Always here. late. Where are you? 
We're gonna fight these people. You there? Have you seen him? You have, s and you're how? She inspects the ring. This. Send uh, Meister Yarrow. Let me think about this. We're pretty weak. Looky, looky. Why don't you? You glance at your Ralvo. Now where'd you go? Hmm. Kind of. I kind of prefer to do the crocodiles first. Yes, I'll have teleport for these guys. It's a bit dangerous if I do it now. Magic trick. And we'll keep. Oh, it's a bit difficult to say, but shocking touch. Alright, quick save here. I could get a better stuff for this. Ah, uh, doesn't really matter that much. I just want to get close and hit once. Doesn't hit, so I'll target the big crocodile. I can't. It's a bit too far. I am delaying here. I'm gonna hit. I'm gonna get hit a few times by fossil fossil strike. That's fine. I wanna see where they go, and I want this thing to get closer. Okay, we're good. I guess I can move a tiny bit. Miss, I stunned that guy. <laughs> okay. How much damage is this? Pretty low. I don't want to do that. Let's get a totem. Okay, we hit that guy. On this guy. This guy is uh, smelly because they only have fossil strikes, so for now we are good. We're gonna have to do this. My damage is not the greatest. Get a totem in place. Hopefully it doesn't die. Doesn't die. <laughs> Two of them are stunned. Uh, I want to... I don't want the totems close or they will die. Mm, saving points for now, we're good. That's fine. Totems have a tendency 
to target the right enemy. I should probably keep like a few healing potions because I don't have healing. So if there's a shocked enemy, the totems will target it. He shouldn't have. Uh, oh, he might kill me here. Uh, we're good. Don't hit me. Not ideal. Alright, so I think we can still do this. Get this guy sleeping for later. Get, uh, kill this guy, I guess. Shock the other. Get a totem. Uh, everyone's stunned or sleeping, so delay. Mm, how do we do this? I mean, I can run away and get frost armor. I can cast this, I guess. Uh, not so bad. Can we get some blood there? I'll do this. Ah, this might be a bit bad. I want to hit this guy as well, but kinda I don't think it reaches. Oh it does, fantastic. Again, this is a difficult fight, so I need like uh, some extra attack. Totems are nice because they apply wet. Lucky to get rain. I mean, lucky to get the hydro from my from my ring. We got teleport now. I've spotted something. Another chest here. Um, we get adrenaline. I'll keep it, even though it doesn't do anything for me. I got the scoundrel too, so we already have our jump. Alright, how much is this? Uh, 2.4, huh? So we'll kill three of uh, the magisters. <laughs>
this is Tactician, we don't use Lone Wolf. Alright, we're gonna get... Uh... Oh, this, this will be slow. Nothing I can do. <laughs> they can go here. And they are trapped right there, so I'm just gonna... I mean, this should probably be good because of the lightning. Yeah, this will take a while. I don't have fire, I don't have poison. I just have auto attacks. They don't even get hit by the electrified water over there. <laughs> Any range character can do this. Some, well, it, take, it will take them a bit longer than others. Like lightning doesn't have dots. Oh, it's targeting the dog as well. I mean, we can do this just to get some more damage going. I should hit the other to electrify the water. That's a nice ricochet right there. But oh well. Sub it short ledge much later, not for now. The alternative if you wanna if you wanna block this is to kite them around which is a bit trickier. But it kind of works okay. At this point I probably want a couple of lightning ones. can stun both of them, well kill one I guess. And at this point I should move forward. Tang. Uh, just in case I'll do this. Thank you. 
Oh, well, I'll tell them there's no water. Not the one I wanted. I can show this right here. You see he's standing on electrified water. We put him to sleep. He's still gonna move. Because he got shocked. I still think that's a bug. But it's like I said, it's a bit slow. Not much we can do. We can, I guess, get the fire or some other dot. Right, give me the key. Uh, maybe necro. Pyro, okay, that's not terrible. I'll get one, I'll get two, and keep this. Now let me approach this area so this guy loads and I can kill him. Totem moment, random. It's uh, always the surface you target. If there's electrified blood or frozen blood or something like that. It can change. Actually not frozen blood, I think it's still still blood totem. Uh... Oh he's gonna Gonna do that, huh? I'm just gonna delay. Ah, should have moved him more. He's not gonna get shocked now. Very annoying.
Okay. Significantly easier when there's only one target. <laughs> now let's do this one. Or maybe not. Let me just skip this. Kinda like it. my totem if we do this here we probably stun her right away wet this guy and it's a question of getting close to this other guy she will get stunned again because it's still raining well she dies That'd be the idea, anyway. Glory is mine. <laughs> My elf instead of human. Human is gonna be for the summoning. So we're doing elf. Which I don't even play that much. Right, let me get this uh, tiny bit of experience here. So we can get four. Do a tiny bit more damage. I could usually kill the three guys up there, but like I said. Those are the same beasts that sank our ship. This build is not great for that. So we can probably do uh, yeah, rain first, and um, probably stun them both, or just this one. Well, that's fine. He needs to get closer through this, and uh, he can't. Were supposed to keep right, that's a four. Get some of that, get some broken. of this, go back here and check for a ring. Nothing. Unfortunate. Hello Roseanne, how are you? I'll keep this, because I didn't have any healing before. Amidst a crowd of screws, bolts, and scraps Geo. of metal, the woman is manipulating a glove-like contraption fitted with five long metal skewers. She Geo doesn't look useless. up as you approach. Unfortunate. I, there are so many things I could use. Like Iro, Hansman, Necro, Pyro. All of that is... All of that is viable. She's got summoning. Oh, that's it. I'll get cloak and dagger. Why don't you take a g Yeah. 
before leaving for the oil, we're just here for a tiny bit more experience. And hopefully a plus one to something useful. Humans and lizards fighting since the dawn of time. Alright. That's not a bad weapon if you get it right away at four. Fire? Not really. Ah, uh, plus one to Iro. Okay, I'll take it. It's not bad. What's this? I found something. Playing with some dude you found through lobby. Ah, uh, Axel's going fine. Still practicing some stuff. That's just to get uh, out of the way. Talk to this guy now. Should have money for everything. One, two, three. I just need three more. I uh, might not have enough. Let me talk to Nebora. Yeah, I'm doing the sorcery for now. Amidst a crowd of screws, bolts, and scraps of metal. Uh, Nebora doesn't have money. Light in your pack, ain't you, girl? Why don't you take okay? 1600, I think it's enough. If it's not, he's gonna die soon, so it doesn't matter. So, what's the news? So, how much is it? 675. Oh, it's not enough. Okay, let me get this too. What? Right, my gloves are just a plus one to just a plus one to memory right now. So as soon as I get something better, need I repeat myself? Stay back. We will get rid of that. What a waste. Come, you'll be needed elsewhere. Don't you hear? I grab all of this, keep it this leg, keep the heal because I am not undead. We'll hold on to this point for a bit more. <laughs> Uh, this guy's here. Come, this way in the back. Follow me. I wonder where this leads. I really want to get some, not summoning a uh, necro soon. Fire. Now let's do this one. This auto attack is. Now we kill Fang for the backpack, some extra gold, I guess. A small wimp, the child. Oh, what? You can the child. Alright, some more experience. Blah, 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 blah. One, two, three, four. Keep that. Where is she? The I fear this happens. 
Get the villain tag, get some money. Better stops. I'm not gonna do auto attacks, so it kinda doesn't matter. I want a couple ones with plus intelligence, most likely. We can go from here. Do one. What is this? 22 plus high crown. It just dies right away. Holding on to my points because I. I'm gonna get some items soon. I'll just walk in here. <laughs> this thing in the water. Uh, is that all? Wow. Necro just for vacuum touch, that's correct. It's a good skill and I one more attack something. that I could have. Like Hydro Mage, but better. Uh, questionable. Very questionable. Alright, we... Yeah, we still need... Still need Necro. Gonna go back up and kill... What's your name? <laughs> Anis. Oh, she's gonna have frost armor. Okay, let's do this. She go over there. I don't want the child to buff her. Should have killed Alice for Necro Gear. Ah, uh, yeah, that's gonna be a no. There's no, there's no good way to kill Dallas for me. Uh, just getting some experience there, a tiny bit more loot, I guess. Um, didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Three hundred, huh? Hey, over here. Hopefully, he drops some gold. He's gonna try to accuse me of stealing. I already ate the book. Simply perfect. Now, teleport me there. Oh, I should probably stand gulf. here so he talks to me. You're almost there. Perfect. Allow the search. Stay here. Perfect. Now, teleport me down. Don't you dare run away. Even the air smells better here above that pit. Thanks for the help, and good luck getting yourself out. 
Eight. I sense some lightning resistance. Just a tiny bit. Should be it, I think. Ah, uh, didn't get my money, I think. Mm, this is better, technically. I'll keep. I mean, I'll just do this. I'll need it later, I'm not gonna use this. I'll keep one more in case we get Necro. And that's pretty much it. So at this point, I think we go up. I'm not mad, darling. I'm not mad. Kill these three. Now it should be easy. Because I have this in bolt. Switch this one for that. Just like that. If it hits something weird like this rope, I'm gonna be so mad. How do we do this? Alright, <laughs> this guy goes first, so... He should get stunned and this one stays asleep. Oh well, that's all of my attacks. <sighs> Alright, we can live for Joy now. Although there's two more guys we could kill. <laughs> what am I missing here? Evasion? will take a bit. That's pretty rude, I'm not gonna lie.
Boris is not having a good day. I'm just gonna do this for the extra damage in here, just to secure. The slip. I'll take a couple hits, that's fine. Oh well. Let's think about this. I'll probably do more int right here. Tiny bit more damage. Hold on to that point until I see the new shops. Mm, we're gonna do a ring. Shocking. Huh? Don't think this hits both. A bit unfortunate. I could perma stand this guy as well, but he kinda was standing not on water there. I'm just 
wait a bit. Delay here because they are stunned. We can do uh, something like this. He gets shocked. Unfortunate. You can see that by just having water totems, you can keep the enemies uh, in place for a long time. I have my totem teleports out of the way. Because I'm gonna stand on lightning. A I'll boat. keep this I'd thank the divine, but for teleport um. scrolls. Um we're gonna save here. I should have uh Ooh, how much is this? 3k point something. The I'm off of this cat and them you the sturdy We made it out. Mm. Good. Better get a move on to safety before anything spots us. Oh that's fine, that's fine. I counted wrong. Just check here. I got six ticks the of experience. Goes. That's because I did everything there was to do. Before leaving. We'll go back soon. I got my five as well. Just want the waypoint. I could have not gotten peace of mind. There's a head on that chest that will give it for free. These plants look truly sinister. They're arranged in a ring. Is that a natural occurrence? Past the head. Now let me try something. Hmm, it works. That way I don't have to go around. I were hoping for gloves, uh, boots, or a belt with plus two to initiative. So I don't have to put points into it. If I can't get that, well, that's fine still. Be 
Alright, have I got any healings? I got first aid, I don't have hands or anything. You tried your best, uh, I don't wanna bite the ring. A grim faced man sifts through a pile of Warfare, wits initiative, one strength, that's a yes a for me. He picks up a rope. Uh, we're gonna the blade nicked and splintered, the hilt twisted. I'm gonna pay first, three hundred. Uh wow. I'll take it. It's gonna be harder to it's gonna be harder to stun people, but I mean that's pretty good. So long as Gareth returns, you will be. Okay, I need the other ring. Might need to steal first. Fever too. Okay, let's check for uh, the ring here. Nothing. Let's see what Nebora has. Amidst a crowd of screws, bolts, and scraps of metal, Iro, the woman not is bad. manipulating a glove-like contraption fitted with five long. And what you after? Not what I need right now, though. Before you stands a figure, her body wreathed in cloth. Which you can see of her eyes are two dark holes in an ornate mask. The birds are asleep. The I, I have a bit of a problem here. Amadi is very. Where I just run out of money. Need to wait a bit. He said his name, but even if I have, I guess I could buy a restoration instead. I didn't think of that. So I already have free hydro. Leave me be. It's quite a lot of experience for this stream. Bring them all back from the brink. Plus a tiny bit of money. What? Please. What? Anna? How do you have that? Uh, she gives me nothing. Just grab whatever expensive. Uh, let's check on X there, he might have something interesting. A young man in oversized armor paces around a table covered Snake. with a spread of maps. Finesse warfare. His face a tight skull of frustration. Strength. Ah, it's gonna be a no. Every he glances up. Who the Echoes of Days, Armadia. Bless her. Hello again, child. Please come back. What brings you here? Air. Yeah, I want a couple of this. But what I have right now it's pretty good. Uh Go. Money problems right now. He works the damaged rapier. So let's to sell to this blade. guy. I already paid him. I could pay Gratiana or Exter now. We're not gonna do it. Alright, so what do I want? Get rid of this. Get this one. Probably get Ebation instead of that. Mm, we're good with this for now. Again, my damage is pretty low. So we can do... Hold on to that. Although I have two points, I can get another polymorph for Medusa head. Not sure if I want it. Void woken. We meet again. Pass away, 
Your essence feeds us. Where's it going though? Not ideal the many and the getting flanked. More of them? These beasts are damn persistent. What's the actual chance? About 14% or something like that. If I have a grenade or something, like this is like the good moment to throw it right there. Not much AoE yet. Only dacing bolt. So we can do uh we can do some poison. Do one of this. This one's not hit, but by the... okay. And we're just gonna back off. Oh, I didn't say this, but the first three guys that spawn, when they explode, they do poison damage. That's why I specifically let them get close. So I can kill two at the same time. Don't hit myself. I'm just gonna keep running. Uh, we can hit this too. Another round. Everything grows here. Tall and strong. And this is gonna be Join 13k us. experience, 1k each of these guys, which is a big chunk for how easy it is. When we get back to Fort Joy, we do a couple more quests, we get our six, we can go for the Salamanders, which are over here, we get the Blood Rose, some more stats, some more waypoints, and we can start killing people. Damage, I'm slightly worried because damage is, seems to be low, because no dots of any kind, and little AoE. Which is a tiny bit of a problem. Not super important or anything. They can keep calling us vermin, but we'll just keep Because we can down. get like Medusa Head or something like that to To cover for that lack of AoE. Kinda. It's like a 2% chance of 2 hits in a row. I've seen worse. Alright, I 
Another grenade, maybe. Who wants to die? Oof, I didn't see that one. Just in case. I know they're shocked, but there's many of them. Ah, uh, can. Can I get like here? Tiny bit more maybe? Not quite. If I delay, we all know what's gonna happen. So let me jump away. Hit three times. How nice. I'm just gonna keep running away for now. I wonder about this. this. Oh, I can't electrify it, huh? Chanterella for invisibility, not like I'm gonna use them, but it's always nice to have. Chain lightning early, huh? Maybe. 
It's okay. Amidst a crowd of screws, bolts, and scraps of metal, the woman is manipulating a glove-like contraption mm. fitted with fire. Your... Your right, we have a few magisters. So... I wonder if I want more memory. Probably, yes. I kind of want lots of memory at the start, so I'll get... I'll get one more now. Uh, probably, probably rain instead. I'll start with Dacing Bolt right there. It's not gonna stun, but it's gonna do quite a lot of damage. Something like this. That guy can't really move because he's wet. If he gets close, he gets stunned. Space him, by the way. Bless will protect you for a few things. Uh, shock is one of them, yeah. Mm. So what am I targeting? Probably the range. Come on, if I just dodge. So annoying. Ah. Oi, sorry. Little accident. Is there anything else outside? We got a thesis already. <sighs> okay, before I put any points, I'm gonna... I'm going... Yeah, with this is fine for now. Uh, when we start getting purple items is when I need to put my points already. Because I could get more arrow for some more damage, I could get more poly, maybe. That kind of thing. Regards from Griff. I get her invisibility potion so this doesn't take as long. in the way, which 
which is not great. This one doesn't count as water for some reason. Or maybe it does. No, it doesn't count. Not real water, it's just something. Thank you for Talk to him, <laughs> check the inventory because otherwise he will have the old books. Wake him up. And just put him to sleep again. This time forever. I don't really need any books, maybe corpse explosion, I can get that later. I hope you love your bell, my friend. Its chimes help you. Another set of nails. So I'm gonna need it soon. Uh, some books as well. Uh, where can I get my extra experience here? Am I five? Still five. Hmm. Unfortunate. Oh, it's fine if I do this now. Just wait uh, five seconds. That's real water, so he gets wet. Chloroform is faster. Blue armor, huh? I only mean that if you think about it logically, right. it's much better. This is I I have to be mindful of this kind of thing. Because if I hit here gets blocked. When I wanna hit this kind of thing, I will target right about here. It's classified as a projectile, surprisingly enough. That's what happened, isn't it? Bleeding snake. Fifty 
Oh boy. Mm, this guy is resistant, I believe. Yeah, 40%. percent not gonna be able to kill him quick. Watch yourself. Well, let me think. We're gonna go this way now. I don't like holding onto my points like this. Walk isn't... I should probably do Necrowan maybe. Not gonna use Bakimora. Mm, we can use Polymorph too. Just for Medusa head. Sounds good. So I have some extra points and yeah, I think we're gonna do that. Just check her inventory again, so it gets updated. Right. Mm. Who are you? Dog is probably not loaded yet. That's why this guy is along. Uh, my stuff doesn't combo anymore. Oh well. Doesn't allow me to perma stun as easily. Still fine though. We got okay -ish damage now. I'll keep 45. Alright, so I'm looking for Metis ahead. Uh, everything else can go. Oh, I'm gonna be short, I think. Uh, nothing from here. I'll take whatever is expensive. Jarrow Girl is resistant to everything for some reason, which is quite annoying. So we'll probably do something like this. Yeah, that's what I imagine. Uh. 
just this almost one today. If only I couldn't turn back time. But I saw that coming. Dang, what? I just have something like. Have I got a shield? No, I'll just use this. Uh, that's right about enough to get six. I have to be careful in this kind of situation. You want to stand in water without magic armor. Now let's check for another ring, hopefully Necro. And we get nothing. Well, this is how it is. Amidst a crowd of screws, bolts, and scraps of metal, Scandal. the woman is manipulating a glove-like uh. contraption fitted with five long metal skewers. She doesn't look up as you approach. I want you off. He works the damaged rapier, trying to straighten the blade. Intelligence. I mean, I kind of want to get this. Constitution and you. Okay, this favorite two. Hello You're again, safe. child. Necro. Ah, oh, let's pay Gratiana. Strength, Targinesis. Looking for two lightning ones with plus int, that's what I'm going for. Go. For some reason I sense someone dying shortly. I wonder why. Leave me. <laughs> Maybe because they have books. Uh, 
Alright, 4, 5, this is 6. It stays on 4. Why is escape not working? Alright, let me get... Uh, we're gonna fight the Salamanders now, so... Maybe Medusa head. What can I? When I, I can go without blinding radiance, but I kind of like having that many attacks. Maybe more memory. Feels excessive. Oh, Dallas, you maniac! Let me count real quick. That's six, so we're gonna get a plus three. So one, two. Jump. Yeah, I think I need more memory. Just one more for now. Use Medusa head and we'll just put uh, intelligence. I think I got pretty much everything. We're just missing Pyro 1. But everything else is good to go like this. Uh, another jump could be nice. It's not necessary. Bless and protect. Your humble servant. Could also do clock and dagger for this you, fight. Who are you? And what do you want? No. Okay, I'll take this. No initiative on any of this. I should pay extra first. 300 as well. Only everyone have physical armor. I mean, that's what masks are, no? But it's more like a chance, not a full resistance. How much is this? 190, 120. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, you go here. Enjoy. That one's stuck for now. I say for now because they can't actually get out. It's just difficult for them. Anything with plus dodge could be nice, so we can get a hundred. We're gonna flank me. Okay, I can take a couple hits. There, there it goes. Like I said, couple hits. Walk to me. Walk with purpose. I am near. I sense your presence. So very far. Right, so how do we do this? So Let me near. think. I guess one auto attack on this. Get the water totem. Attacking that one, so we are pretty much dead. I was hoping he could attack this one. Oh well. That's annoying. I should have put it further away. Mm. Unlikely that I survive this, but we're gonna try. I am death and 
light. If only my totem attacked this thing, I could just shock it. How can we do this? How unfortunate. Everything grows here, tall and strong. Join us. Ah, this got complicated for no reason. I blame my totem. Just one hit. Path is interrupted. What can you do? This thing is creeping from the left. So I have to be careful. Let's do any water over there. Let's try to kill one of these. Or maybe save points. Uh, I think the totem's fine. See how do we do this? Uh, can get close. Can do this. And um, it does not get petrified because it's too far away. Let me heal just in case.
that was difficult. Let's hold on to that for a second. Let's uh, do some damage. Not using blinding radiance because I needed to get out of here. They have to be blind or they hit me with the opportunity attack. Still petrified, we can keep delaying for now and we are pretty good. I was uh Gang, that was difficult for no reason. My thought and attack the wrong target. Unfortunate, it just happens sometimes. I'm looking for I this. Something. Just gonna be. The ring, the gloves, and the mask of the father. Another one of those. Not really. This is a maybe for end game, and this is another maybe for now. The salamander already Careful cleared now. this for me. We're hoping for. Uh, not sure what we're hoping for. Gloves. Okay, I'll take it. Could be good, it could be terrible. Who knows? Is this? If I had tactical retreat, I could get my double jump right here. So I have a ring with Huntsman and a gloves with Huntsman. There's a trap there, I'm gonna get hit. That's fine. We're just walking now. I forgot to go into the cave, so that's uh, can be a problem later when I try to get seven quick. We're just looting for now. Keep the school for later. We can go into the tower, but you get less experience. So instead, I'm just gonna grab the waypoint. This is not a speed run. Are my eyes fooling me? Are my eyes fooling me? This is just a guided playthrough, which is a fancy way of saying I play the game and I explain my decisions and thought process, that kind of thing. Uh, let me go quick. But yeah, even though it's not a speedrun, this what usually this takes space? a long time, so the faster I can go, the better, usually. We're gonna steal the Blood Rose. We do not care about uh, about the wand. So bottle, blood rose, plus one to everything. Soon it'll plus two, more memory, which is nice. Uh, what do I want here? Maybe haste. I don't have pyro. Let's run with Medusa head for now. And if Pyro Wang from somewhere can get it myself, but I'd rather I'd rather get more Iro, I guess. If I can get it from uh yeah, from uh armor. Pyro Huntsman, Necro Hydro. Mercy. Mercy. Barbarism. What happened here? Uh, just like grabbing waypoints, hoping for a good a uh, purple I items. Something. I want a chest armor with plus one to pyro, plus two to something else. That'd be ideal. Oh boy. He works the damaged rapier, trying to straighten the blade. I'm looking for an uh, 
armor, ideally with pyro. It's the only thing that I care about right now. And protect your humble servant. Hello again, child. What brings you here? Nah, it's not gonna work. Shield is a potato. This is absolutely terrible. Go it. Alright, so I can use these boots because I have the finesse now. I can use these because I have the strength. I'm gonna put uh, some nails in there. I might get tactical retreat here, or I'll just grab it from Butter's corpse. Can we go like this? I mean, this is pretty good already. I'd like haste, but I can go without. Alright, so we're gonna start clearing up for Yoi. So this guy over there. Anything I'll you as well. Don't run off now. Just killing her now, because later on, uh, there's no int. Because later on, it'll, it'll be a lot of people from Greaves' team. Oh yeah, that thing. Mm. I'll just get close, that's fine. little experience but as soon as I get seven we can start doing some stuff can I hit this probably not let's go I mean, we can do it from here. Or I can go down. I have some melee attacks. Just getting experience to get seven. I'll get uh, first armor maybe. I'm not gonna use it, but I wanna have it just in case. I'll be nine when I leave this act. We can kill them now. We could do the arena for some. I sold my amulet. Oh boy. Well, we can still do it, I guess. We uh, seek. This is super good already. I don't have haste, which is annoying. Can I go without scoundrel? Hmm. Let's just go like this, I guess. Can we get we this already? You come to f go. Hmm. Let me delay. End game. Uh, I'll be 21. I can be 22 if I wanted, but it's a bit. It's a bit tedious because you have to kill a lot. Plus, going to the second phase. So, not really.
Uh, we're gonna hold on to this. Ring. Everyone kinda dies. Dog as well. And I could literally just do this. And uh, we already won. I'm taking a lot of damage though. Uh, technically on vanilla you can get 25 But uh, not anymore because the sources you could farm before they're they're not in the game anymore It's been fixed most of it Like you can farm the tree guy for example well, You used to be able to Miss You are not intended to get a 25. It's just in the game, just because. You may get a war. Pyro, there we go. I do one more point here. Keep this. Keep that. We can get that. As soon as I get globs, I can get rid of that. Alright, we're gonna kill these people as well. Uh, I mean, I just did that. Uh, maybe one of these. So it can start doing something. Quite brave. So we are clear. It says 80% dodge. What this means is their chance to hit is 20%. 20%. They are blinded. Minus 35. It's minus 35% of 20%. Doesn't mean 20 minus 35. It means 20 times. 0 0.65 that's their chance to hit me if they have a hundred accuracy it's multiplicative it doesn't it's not like i'm dodging a hundred fifteen percent because they have less accuracy they can still hit me just like a minus 35 percent out of 20 percent so about 14 percent chance to hit me because i'm getting flanked right now just in case it's not clear, or it looks like a bug or something like that, it is not. That's how it works. And I forgot about that. I 
that right there is what I was talking about. They are shocked for two. I tried to try to shock for one. It does not work. It's just how it is. It used to work, so I'm assuming it that's a bug right now. Happens with the AE. Happened with the Hydro as well, I talk about that a lot. Uh, we can just go here. I'm slow. What? Everyone's dead. Again, just collecting experience towards 7. So we can get it on time. The boar is gonna remove my collar now. Someone has my amulet eyes, from before. Manages a wink before return. Good to see. Don't really wanna buy it back. This is gonna be expensive. Although I have 4k now. That's the blood rose, plus one to all the stats. It'll be plus two when I get a uh, five star at eight. Right, we're just gonna go from here. Uh, don't think I have enough damage. I wonder. There's one extra ranger because I didn't kill her, but probably not necessary. You can just steal it, you don't need to fight. Oof, that's good damage, what the fuck? What's my high ground? 20%, how is that so high? I guess they don't have resistances. Who else is on this? Uh, we can probably, probably, probably do something here. Oh, hi. Ah, uh, the range is more dangerous. Cork will be fine, I think. It's not like he's gonna take a million damage or anything. Alright, I'm delaying here so I can actually keep him alive. It's not necessary, but just because. Don't hit me. Oh, I should have used this while they were not petrified, because this thing gives a uh, tiny bit of error resistance, but you know, just optimizing that kind of thing. They're gonna be petrified a bit more. Uh, Gonna survive.
So how does one save cork? I guess that works. Why me? Exactly what I wanted to do. Hmm. Subdue them. And make sure Cork doesn't leave. I was a bit of a messy fight. Still works. Initiative? Oh, okay. 23, why is it so high? Oh, piece of this. Now uh, we can get this. Uh, rid of that, this one. Um, now we need a couple ones with intelligence if possible. That'd be fantastic. How many nails have I got? Six. Uh, I'll grab a few more here. Probably nothing good. These chests are a low level. I'm gonna think about this. Kinda hard to tell. Mm. 
Oh well, I guess, I guess we can do this. I'll use this for a bit more, until I switch my weapon. walking. He can jump, I encourage. Sometimes he will walk. That is very annoying. Quite enough to kill him. This will be a crit. Not quite, huh? quick save in case, you know, I get hit three times in a row. Unfortunately, he might he heal. This. One of these has a potion, I think it's this one. Maybe it's both. Nice grenade, by the way. I need to delay, but it's a bit dangerous. I'm gonna get bashed in the head twice. So how do we do this? We got some beautiful rain in here. Let's keep getting distance. Mm. 
we can go up here. Just recovering my evasion and getting high ground. Might be too far. Now nah, we're good. See, so yeah, I might, might blitz me in which case. Eh. Not that big of a problem. This guy is annoying because he's gonna bash me. Uh, let me think. Teleport. Oh, that actually hits. Surprise, he's not trying to knock me down. Annoying. Okay, uh, he's shocked. So I'm actually gonna delay. Interesting. We're just not going for it, huh? Not many more healings, so something has to die here.
I can see like a good setup for this. I have to run away. <laughs> Maybe I'll... Hmm. Maybe I'll use the drawing here. What's not being useful? Probably this. <laughs> Some like adrenaline can help. Let me move the magisters. I'll go back up in a second. Blocking it there. Can I wait one more? Uh, probably not. I'll delay here. I wanna see if this works. He's gonna use frost armor. Yeah, that's a bug as well. Or I don't know if it's intentional, but it immediately fails. Like the game doesn't give it armor before he gets petrified again. I'm just gonna keep delaying. This is a bit tricky. Was he not stunned or am I... 
Oh, he might have been petrified, maybe. Hmm. That was weird. Might be dead here, maybe not. <laughs> Blitz. No blitz. I am not delaying, so I am dead. It's unfortunate. Okay, let me think about something real quick. Like, before... Like, those two hits I took... Maybe he was petrified and I didn't realize. This kind of fight, I think Totem is not that good. They're not gonna stay alive more than one turn, usually. And sometimes I wanna choose who I attack. So if I do something like this, we kill one, go down. You can't change kills during combat, you have to go outside of combat. <laughs> Which is what I did, going downstairs. Ah, uh, not quite enough. I'll save AP more like yeah. Oh wait to restore armor. I got frost armor but I'm not gonna use it. tell you that it's very annoying
Okay. Oh well, I guess we're reset in this fight. We have no magic armor. How is this guy alive? Vacuum Touch Necro Iro, that's decent damage Suffocation and uh, Silence if they have no armor <laughs> Alright, we're almost there This fight is very annoying Invisibility, most likely with evasion, but can't want to. <laughs> My methods will bring you closer to his. Ah, uh, this is pretty much just yes. getting here. Your source. Uh, how much is this? Let's do one more place, just in case. This is not quite enough. You can see the difference between having to run away and actually just doing damage. It's much much easier. 
That's why invisibility is so strong. This fight in particular is annoying because they can heal, frost armor, restoration and haste. Plus the other guys will bash you with shield. Uh, we got some dogs in there, we'll go in a second. Those dogs sound out blood. What's my movement? 6.1. That's pretty good. As for the dogs, well, this is gonna be problematic. Let me do that from outside. We go inside and grab this guy there. <laughs> Just so we can slang everyone. Uh, goes first okay make to make sure they range die Very little they can do now. They'll probably hit me three times or something like that. Unfortunately for this dog, I'm not undead, so I can't play dead. The dog's tech. And the fastest way to do this is to kill him. Uh, we're getting close, like it's going slow, but there's lots of things to do. But we're getting close. Restoration, is that lightning? No. no. Flesh not freely given, stolen blood, sickening. Uh, we might craft a few of this. Is they. I don't know why, but they happen to go well with lightning. It's that kind of thing. 
We're gonna have to kill a few silent monks still. Just have to do the same rotation every time. Uh, tiny bit more HP. Very convenient having pools of blood or water just laying around. That's what I was looking for, earth essences. I explained this, but I'll say it again. The only attack that will stand by itself is Dacian Bolt. Again, it's probably a bug. Which is really annoying. If I do this while he's standing on blood, Shock for 2 and Electrified Water, but he's not getting stunned. Which should be the case, or it was for a long time. I talked to Niles. Mm, who are you? He reaches out. Mm, please, Wha whatever. He's less. Give him a Tusa's leg, which is what uh, why I've kept it this whole time. Trying to get in a specific spot. If I can't, I'll just jump. Enemies without armor will bleed, obviously. Not, not all of them, but most enemies will bleed. So, you know, blood, automatic stun. We just grab this one in particular, so the cage is free. Yeah. 
anything to look my way. Hello? Busy caressing a two So I need to look at this spot so I can teleport this guy and not aggro anyone. Alright, so this is problematic. I kind of don't want to, but I have to do this. That's fine. We're just gonna kidnap them one by one, this one as well. Niles is on the cage, so he cannot join the fight. It's an actual mechanic in the game. He's even got dialogue for that kind of thing. Everything grows here. Tall and strong. Join us. Alright, so one. Two. And three. That's why I wanted Necro this whole time. This attack is really nice. There's a tiny bit of an explosion there when they die. It's like 60 fire damage. But it's like a really, really tiny explosion. Right, let's wait for this. I'll just do something like that. Mm, yeah, maybe this one. So he's still shocked. Waiting for this guy to come out. You can hear him complaining about being caged. We'll wait for the other guy, so right about here. Doesn't get hit because the cage is in the way somehow. And uh, we can just... I'll have to do this. Thirty-three. Why so high? I can <clears throat> make this ahead for enemies with uh, no magic armor naturally. It's just super powerful. They're kinda resistant to too many things. I could use Rang. kind of slow though. Uh. And this guy is still complaining. I want to see the dialogue though. He's not talking for some reason.
Come, come, darlings. Oh, he recovered Time armor. To die That's annoying. Papa. Seven, eight, twenty-four. Not really. It's relatively easy to perma stun one enemy. As long as they're alone. He's gonna get stung on his turn, so I get a double turn. It's really convenient when enemies, for some reason, don't get stunned when you shock them twice. Like now, he was shocked, he was standing on electrified water, but it didn't proc because it was not his turn. So when it's his turn, immediately he takes damage, he gets uh, he gets stunned, then I go. I can delay, he's still stunned. It's like when you delay and you get knocked down or something like that, or when you're, it's your turn. And you slip on ice, you lose that turn and the next one because you have to get up. It's that kind of thing. Uh, we'll hold on to that for a sec. As soon as we're done with Fort Joy, we can start walking toward Tromdoy, most likely. Which is, uh, I think it's gonna be fine. He's resistant to water and water and earth, I believe. Preemptively cast right here. So if he goes invisible, I'll see him. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Imagine dodging instead of getting hit every single time. I'll probably stun myself. Yeah, I got only a tiny bit to her. Oh, I got zero. What? I thought I had some pants with error resistance or something. Now we can just do that and they die.
Missing a petrified enemy? Yeah, it never happens. How can you miss a target that's standing still? Alright, uh, we got uh, water. How much? 40%. So I'm guessing this guy is also 40% lightning. If uh, the restoration maybe be a good moment to use it, let's do. Oh, I wonder about this. Let's do something like this. Well, I could sneak, but it's not. Uh, this might be a bit dangerous. Which one is the one I have to break? I think this one. I don't know if that works. The plan is to get a petrified guy here. Let's see if it works though. Interesting use of your AP. Sure about that. Twenty seven. Okay, just in case. Why can't I see him? Maybe one step here. This one's just in case. It's gonna be really annoying if I get stunned. Tried. Fail? Yeah. It should not fail like that. Oh well, what can you do? That's very nice. Three guys petrified. I'm just gonna stand here and get hit twice. Maybe three times.
The rain is coming back up in a second, so we can shock everyone. Probably should get high ground for this kind of thing. How much is this? I should learn this, I guess. Minus 15. I'm assuming this is minus 20. Ah, uh, minus 15. So it's the same, huh? Should probably still take damage like that. Imagine not having any kind of CC. I'm not being a necromancer. Something like that. A warfare. Don't really want that. Hmm. Only 15 wits here. You know this. To see this thing. Suicide bombing. I mean. <sighs> Unstable is just another. Another level of play. But yeah, you can see how just having this ahead allows me to get so many turns. Like random skills like that are very good. Uh, this is all done, I believe. Uh, we've gone outside, cork these guys down here. Uh, we're missing the dungeon, I guess. 75, it's going okay. Like all these small, well, sh small, more like short fights. Mm, we can do this. How dangerous is this? I'm gonna delay right away. Fire, huh? Okay, so. this not sure what this guy's problem is like probably gonna throw a couple arrows try to knock me down it's just 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 stay here that's pretty smart still not enough Oh, Dolores is dying. Uh, quick, quick, give me my turn. Oh boy. Ah, 
he's fine. Six. Let me move a tiny bit more. Oh well, it doesn't matter, we'll kill this guy now. Let me delay so he doesn't do anything. Um, get some value here. If I got a bit closer to him, I guess I can drop the blood right under so he gets stunned. Uh, what can we do here? Well, that was a poor block on my part. The color white in the uh, he'll come back later. As always, this is the kind of fight that you could do earlier. Uh, it's, I mean, it's not that difficult as long as you stay away. Or you get rid of the archers or something like that. Taking one word in every conversation. Not really. Most conversations are fine. Some will get you instantly killed or something like that. Oh, it's here. Where did it come from? Was it here the whole time and I just didn't see it? Is that that's that's possible? It happens. Okay, never mind, I'm just blind. Alright, come here. Everything grows here, tall and strong. Well, a tiny bit more Join damage, us. that's it. The lucky charm is relevant, I guess. Ah, oh, it's not ready. <laughs> Let's delay, see what they do. Explode on that, but they do little damage, so supposed to be an early game fight. Oh well. The bizarre creature. Oh. 
I like how I attack this thing, but it doesn't see me because of the smoke. Ah, uh, we can just wait. They're weak to water though. I got so many things on me. Let's uh let's start selling. He works the damaged rapier, trying to straighten the blade. Okay, life steal is not what I want. Uh, dodge instead of movement. I like the movement. I'll take this anyway. Alright, so... What's so expensive? Bless and protect your humble servant. Hello again, child. Oh, what brings you here? Come back. Initiative, uh, blind. I'm looking for. What am I looking for exactly? I'm looking for plus intelligence. Uh, maybe initiative, but initiative by itself is useless. Go. Uh, she can identify Hello this again. thing for me. What brings she's finessed, you all use this. Go. Now don't you cry. No, no. You, the who are you? And what do you want? Uh, initiative, Huntsman, Strength, Water. So close your sweet eyes and rest your wee head. Ah, uh, not this one. Two of those. <laughs> All right, let's just go like this. Of death. I'm gonna prepare one of those. Best they can do with those colors. Alright, what am I missing exactly? I'm missing like a tiny bit of experience. Uh, we haven't done the frogs, we haven't killed Griff. So we can do that now. We're missing exactly 4k, so yeah, let's do the frogs first. Oh, there's a dog. Was there the whole time? Roll high. Oh, it's resistant. What? Random dogs resistant to lightning for no reason. Okay. You're too slow. You're I, I need. Uh, not not like I need, but I want. Uh, I want haste for this real quick, so I can start teleporting and using the in bolt. I should jump first. Uh, what did I take? Not running, probably. Easy 
just so we can do this. They start wet. So, freeze time. This thing is uh, immune to lightning. Uh, how much is this? 20. Not quite enough. I haven't got any AOE. I can do this, I guess. Two auto attacks again. This thing is immune to air. There's a chest which is gonna have nothing, but I'll grab it anyway. Just money, probably 45. Just collecting experience. Huntsman initiative, that's uh, okay. Uh, no, I'd rather do something like that. I already had them though. We talk to this guy. State your business. So, if they are close, that'd be fantastic. She does not give experience, neither does Amiro. Might get knocked down. Unlikely that I die though. He's going for the cripple. Interesting play. Train, but let's go. Just don't hit myself. What's my armor? 52. Oh, okay, there's uh, something up there. Alright, Sahila gives experience, but she will give more later, so she needs to stay alive. Plus, she deserves to see everyone she knows dead. Alright, again, this is the point where I did the sebang, but I didn't go into the cave, and I did say it before. I'll still uh, tactical retreat here, I guess. Although, mm, probably not. I'll just walk.
need to switch this stuff. Like I got 17 initiative because of this. The int is nice. But if I can get like two lightning ones, I was get. Let's get something good. He works the damaged rapier, trying to straighten the blade. Oh, this is all mine. Initiative, well, that's unknown. Poison, fire. Ah, uh, to end. But it's poison, and uh, we're going, uh, going to fight undead right now. So. Platform next to the cave entrance. Do you mean the one on the right hand side where the contamination book is? Please. Hello again. So I already Tell went there. What brings you here? Uh which summoning. Say this could be nice to get earlier. One arrow. Hmm. Smoke and screams. Echoes of death. Go in our I'll get white ones if I have to. You, who are you, and what do you want? Hmm. I'll get that one. And let's check Nevora one more. She looks at you with wet eyes and manages a wink before Hi, returning again. to her. Good to see. What's the kid half? Geo and socket. Well, that's rare and useless. Time for Trompe he works the damaged rapier, trying to straighten the blade. No lightning though. Mm. Who else sells what? Maybe Salisker. The hooded man exudes a restrained menace that near matches your own. As he raises mm. his head, the hood falls back. Revealing the gleaming bone visage of an undead. I mean, this is cool and all, but not really what I want. I had 350 for Salskar. Something like that. Yeah. Beautiful. Perhaps I can even. I lose and I. I get dual welding ones, I guess. They obviously are pretty bad. Dead magisters. I wonder who did this. No, oh, there's a dog in the way. Attacks, so get her here. She's still wet, so that's nice. Should probably get close to drop the blood on her, but whatever. Now we can do this. Because I'll run out of CC. 
if I don't. The Magisters aren't the only ones looking for me, but who is it? Torch is and, and interesting. A What's new face. I found something. Water and cliff, not what I want. Iro. Huntsman. I already have Huntsman, I think, yeah. There's one more fight behind me. I'm gonna leave it for later. I'm gonna see if I get lucky with this uh, purple item. I've spotted something. Necro, I already have it. It's more armor, I think. No, it's less. It's gonna hit the tree. Oh. That's why I want double wand. I literally, oh man, if I miss that, I can do that, I mean, he ju she just gets perma stand. it's kind of annoying when this happens. I, it works anyway. Could be problematic if at some point I run out of uh, CCs, but having more doesn't hurt. And they're free, I guess you just have to auto attack. I hoping for a uh, wand, maybe? Another shield, fantastic. I left one chest. Uh, here. What's the difference between our uh, hand? What's the difference? Ah, uh, wand. It says like if I and it doesn't. Uh, I don't think there's any difference. I'm not aware if there's any difference. Uh, if it has lightning, it will electrify the surfaces. Is this porn? Oh, I know what you mean. We already went that way. Like to get the blood rose early. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Come on, it's three shields already. Ugh. What? Some sort of He works. That's not what I want. Trying to straighten And the they're way. probably bad as well, yeah. Hello again, child. That's not helping what me. What brings you here? Go in Armadia's grip. Got 9k. You, who are you, and what do you want? Now let's see, Trombo. How do we do this? Next level, I'll get uh, one, two. I'll get two more memory. So we'll probably do haste and um, peace of mind, or we can do haste now. Since I didn't get any, since I didn't get any, uh, what is it called? Oh wait, I did. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I thought I didn't have my armor yet. That's nice, so we can do haste. Hmm, that's fine. Probably more points into int. I need to think about this. 17. Maybe elemental totem.
So we'll do three IR of use. I need chain lightning. I, I'll probably use it. It's one more attack. Huntsman. Uh, I got Huntsman too if I need to. Necro for free. Pyro for free. Cloak and Dagger for free. The problem is summoning, I guess. Hold on to my other point. Hey! So we'll do one, two, and three. Quite the vision, aren't I? You should go. Before you get Oh, one more. Nice. So how do we do this? Mm. I think I'll just trigger the fight and get away. Why well, kill this one? Because I need to retreat. Didn't I tell? If he's alive, I can't do this. Exactly do I mean by get it played through. I play the game and I explain why I do the things I do, basically. That's the general idea. Looking for the high ground. Something like this. Get some rain. do this for the movement and get closer this guy needs to die real soon let me think about this uh, we'll probably do this Who shall I teleport? Probably this guy. I can't see either, so... I'll just reset the fight. Mm, maybe I want haste for this. it is happening maybe if I get close so cool when enemies are not resistant to me
Yeah, that's a mistake it made before. If uh, oh, why am I shocked? If uh, the guy is standing on electrified water after I attack twice, after he got stunned, he doesn't get shocked until his turn. So there's no way for me with auto attacks to stun him again, unless I teleport him far away. Get so now. the surface procs. And then I can just auto attack one more time. Mm, we'll keep that. One, two. You come to find. Do you wish to listen? Brack, either you'll listen. So, baby, I brack, brack, chop. When do I plan to use Elemental Affinity? Probably never. Elemental Affinity is questionable on this build. It's good if you just wanna unload all of your attacks. Open your eyes. But most of the time that's not what I do, so... Now let's get some distance right away. A bit early for this. We are most likely getting 5 star at 8, Sabit Short Tillage at 13, um, at 18 it'll be Hothead, I guess. It kind of depends. I can I delay here or is it terrible? Show yourself. Look at these guys. No resistance to lightning. Okay, let's do. Uh, rain is a bit of a waste. She'll proc again on my turn, so just keep haste. Gonna hit this guy. That's fine. I wonder. Mm, let's back off. Reveal yourself. No, oh, it's down in there. This guy doesn't wanna get close because electrified water. So we can probably hmm, we can probably stun one. Get some more distance just in case. The other the other one will get stung on its turn. Yeah, that's fine. Keeping in place if I can target. Just raining a couple attacks and regular auto attacks as well. Uh, I wanna hit this. I'll waste one AP, like it's fine. He's gonna get stung on its turn again. Shocked, standing on water. As soon as it, as soon as he goes, he gets stunned. Might get hit once. That's fine.
wonder if I, I'm gonna delay or not. I wanna save points, but I also wanna use this. Questionable invisibility. Uh, this guy will get shocked. Uh, I kind of want to delay. I'm still dodging for a bit. If I get a belt with 7 dodge, that'd be ideal. Oh well. <laughs> That's. <laughs> Unfortunate. I was gonna teleport him away. Alright, one AP attack. Um, we haven't got the rain yet. Mm. Stun for free. Uh, this guy is annoying. He's 45 now, which is even more annoying. Oh. He can actually cross. Okay, we're just gonna play a little game of closing the door. Not the best use of my AP, but uh, it works. Close the door, wait for phase two. Actually, retreat as much as possible. You won't know what hit you. Another excellent use of invisibility. It's tempting to just kill this guy, but uh, I'm gonna retreat fully. Let's wait for the water to just disappear. Okay, there we go. We look at him go. If we want like a good rotation, I think it's something like that. You can see just having... I'm gonna get shocked myself. Just having a couple of white... Uh, White lightning once and just rain. It's more than enough. Okay, I want this guy. It is something, huh? I wonder. I wonder. Oh, I'm not undead. That's so weird. Mm, not quite, but he's wet, so he's gonna get stunned on his turn. We 
can just keep doing damage for now. Creep closer. Standing on water, what do we do here? Uh, kill one. Not sure if he's dead or not. I'm shocked myself, that's fine. What happened to my armor? I take so much, so much damage for no reason. Minus 30, huh? You go here while I recover. I go up here. Demonic invasions? Is then that like a PoE mechanic or what? Starting to think that I kinda need a tiny bit of uh, air resistance so I don't keep losing my armor. Wake to lightning, huh? Hmm, let's do something like this. Is that enough? Is that enough? Not quite. Not quite. I'm fine, worry not. It's little else he can do. Demonic invasion, demonic possession. Just yes, use a red potion and it will give you immunity to a lot of things. Craft, uh, hold up. Oi! I need to not stand in water. Alright, I got, uh. Oh, I don't have, I don't have, uh, right now, but. Empty potions and red essences, fire essences, will give you a potion that gives you immunity to most, uh, you know, mind effects like uh, charm, mud, those kind of things. For four turns, so you're pretty good with that. How are you not? If I do this, I'll probably shock myself. Yeah, there we go. As you pick you up. Uh, there's a chest over here, doesn't have anything, but I still want to pick it up. Uh, something like that. Waiting for teleport. <laughs> Hello Kendo, you alright? Again, just having two lightning ones gives you so much uh, CC potential. Plenty. What's my weight at? I'm so skinny today. What's happening? Look at that wand. It hums with crossbow. Not ideal. I'm he tran I'm as long he drops 
nothing out of this is gonna help me, so just grab whatever is expensive, keep the jars, keep the wand, everything else can go. Not planning on using supernova. We got uh we haven't got bless yet. We have got less now. <coughs> Halfway to eight. So let's give Gratiana her jar. She stopped. You you don't touch. She read you see a group. Not interested on her story. I already know how it goes. You, who are you, and what do you want? The seven was us. You're safe in bed. Please, Maybe some boots or some Bless good you. amulet. What brings you here? Fire, intelligence, and socket. Ah, uh, that's fine. Go. You, who are you, and what do you want? Just so I have three percent dodge. It's pretty much the same. I don't care about uh, like charm. <laughs> so what am I missing now? Uh, we have a couple fights here. We have the big fight, which I kind of forgot about. Fort Joy. We have Grief alive. Let me fix that real quick. Edna to the kitchen. Right. Just wanna check her inventory and heal the swell. Good. Hey, why don't you take a gander? And Griffs, just because. Ah, oh, you're back. And we'll just teleport her there. Stay where you are. Don't move. Everyone's shocked. Don't know if that's enough. Not quite. He's gonna frost our more grief. That's annoying. Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting.
I like how she takes one damage and just uses a 120 potion right away. She seems to understand that consumables are made to be used. I want this guy's one. Is it worth losing damage for one more end? I think it is. Now, lots of things here. I just want. This one, everything else can go. Where's my necro ring? What? All right. 61. Nothing else to do in Fort Joy. Nebora's still alive, but she's cool, so this guy's over here. We should do these three fights. I'm gonna use this just for the extra damage. Uh, 26. Yeah, this is enough. I can probably. like that guess there's no need huh I'll just wait here for them to get close to me He's still here. I feel like he's right down there.
memory. Hmm. Okay, let's do something like this. How many attacks is that? Five. Kind of want to delay. Where can I hit? Only there. Should probably shock first so I don't miss. Wait a tiny bit more, see what they do. I don't want Saldascar in this combat, so I'll probably jump right there. This guy got lost. Miss, miss. a couple times more skill than necromancer you don't need skill in this game you can just play whatever and it just works One more on your end. That's uh, spread your wings. I already have my jump, I'm happy with that. How do we do this? I feel like I feel like we're just gonna uh, prepare some of this bullshit. Let's do one ring. I can't play dead. Have to go back in a second.
Alright, for some reason, Larian should know why. Silent Monks and Magisters are not on the same faction. Like, they will join the fight and whatever, but they're not actually part of the same faction. So if you do some weird shit with uh, water and lightning here, they go into combat with each other. It just works. So now I'm just gonna chill while they fight each other. If I feel like it, I'll join and do some damage. But they don't even know I'm here. Automized. No, yeah, well. It happens with Niles as well. You can aggro the silent monks. Imagine playing on our mode for this kind of thing just so you can't do stupid things. I feel like attacking, but I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna be patient. How many times past the game? I don't know, many. Totems of the Necromancer is a completely viable skill to set up a uh, thick of a fight for 80, 80 plus enemies or 80 plus characters and then use something stupid. I doesn't even... Doesn't even do good damage normally. Temple with all the citizens. Uh, I don't even say that, and I. It sounds so laggy. I need to join this fight at some point. Let me just haste. Something died. There's only one alive. Oh, I'm gonna stay. Let's see what they do. I 
Well, playthrough on YouTube where I more or less regularly use Earthquake. Uh, the Rogue used Earthquake occasionally. The Warrior as well. So, okay, knockdown. Don't like being next to a uh, next to an oil barrel. Gonna delay, even though it's not the best right now. Okay, this guy went the other way for some reason, so we're gonna use that time. Rang is not coming up. Oh, I have invisibility. Okay. Don't really want it. Oh boy. I hit this thing with my lightning. If I hit these guys, I'll just use a rain scroll or something. Now it's gonna... As long as it doesn't hit me with Wild Wing, we're good. We got rank, so we we'll probably do this one first. <laughs> he got shocked all the way there. Let's wait for him. Alright, then we got a double turn here. So I'll probably start stunning people. This guy is probably not standing in blood or something. I don't know what's happening with him. No, oh, he's not actually. Interesting. I'll probably shock myself, I'm not sure. Yeah.
Oh, interesting. Now you're gonna get stunned. Huh. Yeah, this uh, magic armor is a bit of a problem when everything is water. Am I very good at this game? I just play this game a lot. That's best I can say. Alright, we're good. Uh, Salmon Monks will not have anything useful. 72%. How much is this? 15. Um, almost 8. I'm not sure if I reach with just the next fight. <laughs> this is gonna be interesting though. I don't have dots. And they're kinda spread apart. Traveler. You are sick at heart and weary of limb. Come here, rest with me in the sun. Something like that. I'm gonna wait to see if they move. Samo, thanks for the uh, for, for this half. Thank you. Let me. How much murdering does one speak? Oh, I know what I want to do. I know what I want to do. Let me get these people together. We lost so many men and still never got through the last day. Keep a sharp eye. Once the seeker is dead, we can follow the cart to the Lady Vengeance. Please, Agro, don't make me. Can't believe we lost so many men and still the, never a cup and end this, but you haven't. You what? It's a terrible place to get lost, friend. The Majesty. Oh, bro, little did the fool know. Thalys, not that it matters now. Quick, ah. What? I wanted Can't to fight. So Where's this guy gone? Through the last gate. Can't believe we lost so many men. Yeah, let's still do. Still never got through the last gate. Let's got armor here. 80. Okay, that's Keep a right. sharp eye. Once the seeker's dead, we can follow the cart to the lady vent. I didn't get uh back in touch. Oh well. It's a bit of a problem, but <gasps> might just work. Ah uh, boy. Oh boy. When's the last save? Are we doing this? Yeah, we're doing this. Hey Gareth, you fucking need to survive like two turns while I kill these people. Okay, just fall. Whew. Need Gareth to be smart and just destroy the archers. Oh, there's one there. I got a double turn here. Uh, let me think. 
We can do with this ahead and keep these people in place. Hmm. Seems like the play here. Let me think, let me think. We clearly want... Uh, I don't have any more fire. I'll get some poison maybe. Nah. I wonder, I wonder. Not ideal. Okay, let's do this. Twenty three, come with me. Ah, oh, this guy didn't fall. Okay, okay, okay. Gareth's doing great. He's doing things. Uh, let me just play very optimal. Something like that. I don't mind wasting that because I have to delay anyway. Yeah, just execute her. Let's go. He's doing... he's doing okay. I need to go and help soon though. We're delaying. Crit. Okay, okay. Frost armor, it's gonna fail. It didn't fail, okay. So how is this gonna work? Twenty-seven, I need to do a uh, one attack here. Okay, this is... Mm. This is pretty much under control, I was gonna say, before getting shocked. <laughs> I 
I kind of want to do some swap real quick. Uh, we don't have the right target. Scarlet should be killing this woman. Okay, this one's gonna get shocked on her turn. And I can get a double turn for the other. If got oh that's so unlucky. Or maybe not. Uh, she's not designing, that's okay, I think. If Garrett dies here, you kinda carry on. You don't need Garrett to complete the game. Uh, you can convince Exeter, I believe, to be the leader temporarily. Uh, so what do we do here? We just delay. Gareth is doing well. He's not supposed to die in the game, only Malady. But she can die still. Interesting lightning. They're just throwing at this point. <laughs> I, I should probably. Focus on this one. Garrett is winning by himself. Jesus. What is this? 40, 30%. I'm just gonna keep shooting. Gareth, come on. Your god is invulnerable, like, doesn't take any damage while you attack him. Okay, I'm gonna have to do this. I can't hit Gareth. He's trying so hard. Oh boy, I fucked up. Uh, let me stun twice. There we go. Come on, Gareth. Two hits. One more. Yeah, like I'm gonna let him die. Yeah. 
your courage in the his eye. Your name's are I get I got I Wow, so close to fucking this up. I think I picked the wrong option. I they should I passed the persuasion check by mistake. I wanted to fail and I actually passed it. We'll get five star dinner at uh five star diner at eight. And I'll reload and we'll get plus two to every stat. Fucking hell, that was difficult. Not having, yeah, that's that was a problem. Not having vacuum touch, like one less attack, makes a big difference. Because I'm not gonna use invisibility here while Gareth dies. What could this mean? But this ahead though. I'll get eight here. Knowing the reputation. And we'll see what uh what I get on the traders. Before you. Right, so uh, diner. you can see that it says plus two here, but it's not true. We're gonna quick save and reload. I need to remember to save before the Gareth fight every time. There's nothing out to save there, and it kind of. It's a disaster with the ranger because I had to redo the whole from toy fire. Alright. Plus two to everything now. Plus two memories. That's pretty nice. We can get this. Uh, maybe totems. Maybe adrenaline better. 18. Alright, so... I smell... burning! Are those pigs on fire? Mmm... yeah... One more? There we go. The menacing... So you dare defy... Why wouldn't... I hope this brings the disgust... It is not... Besides that... She moaned... One did not make a deal... It is me. The god. Alright, you just stall until you can get to. Ah, oh, did I get the waypoint? Mm, no, I didn't. You just stall until you can get your your persuasion check. You need 13 wits for that. No need to have any persuasion, and you're good to go. Alright, we get. Do I want this? Not really. It is not a bug, it's intentional. It's how it works. Uh, I'm not gonna loot anything. Alright, another... Another purple item. It's uh, it's gonna be a shield, I can already see it. Pants, okay, that could be good. It's finesse though. Oh, no fire. Everything grows here. Tall and strong. Join us. I'm trying to hit this oil, but I'm, I'm not able to. Oh, that's easier.
just gonna trigger this fight. Not like I'm gonna do it now. Uh, we can go from here. He works fast, checking weapons to see if they're battle right, What am I getting? He thumbs the edge of a blade. It draws blood. He grins. Nothing interesting. The blade is. My eternal thanks, friend. This is a debt I can never repay. Oh, what you got for me? Higher damage, lightning. Ah, uh, not what I want. Did you see? Garrett's back. He's here to take us home. The young man has abandoned the maps and now prepares his armor with happy urgency. Ah, uh, finesse and pyro, I guess. I do more with uh, chloroform. Shields, shields, shields. Thank you now. Uh, what? It's peaceful here. Blessed oh, Amar, my eternal thanks. Swamps. Friend, this is a debt no. I can never repay. Ah, uh, maybe? Not really. The young man has abandoned the maps and now prepares his armor with thank you now. I need to send uh, these people. My Lucian's locks stop fidgeting, lad. Where's Gareth? This one might serve, but. You come, I don't know that you get she got with she where I we fight still you I get with now we have a couple more fights. We're gonna start I want chain lightning already, so I'm gonna start this one. Hmm, what's my last uh, thingy? It's not peace of mind yet. Don't need it for this fight. The stone gargoyle tree. You are not. You may, you may, maybe you'll find they all. Careful. I've spotted a trap. Bluff. I'll think about this fight. I could come later with chain lightning, but. Maybe totems. These skulls crumbled to dust. The gargoyle. Bring me this. How do we go about this? Huh? Uh, how do we cast this? Probably like this.
interesting. One more. Ah. Oh. There goes my ace. If I can get them in place one more turn. Something like. Yeah, you know, something like this. Probably not necessary to throw a grenade, just something like that. <laughs> okay, you are going for a walk. It's got too much armor, I can't break it right away, so... It's already here though. <laughs> that didn't do much. He probably doesn't have many more attacks. I could hope. Okay, we go here. It's sapping me for some reason. Lose haste. 
That was a rough start. Oh well. As long as I can break their armors, everything is fine. I got CC for forever. Kind of too far for this. Drop some blood on this guy. We are not really gonna bless him. He drops experience when he dies. The only difference is that there's no portal here, but it doesn't matter because you can just jump. Another shield. This is Kurt. Okay, that's better. Much, much better. Now, the reason I'm doing this is because I want uh, chain lightning. Another skull crumbled to bits. Careful now, that's a trap. I could have done it much earlier, just Another going skull. all the way around. Yes. But I need the skulls to get the good reward, which is gonna be two purple items. The stony. You. So we get nothing. Scoundrel to pyro. That's nice. Too finesse. Okay, we got uh, we got a new armor, which is not that one, which is gonna get me. Pyro and Scoundrel, so where's my other Scoundrel there? Pyro. Okay, I got nothing better, but I could switch my helmet if I have something better. Boots. Still using the teleportation gloves, I didn't find... I guess we can do this. Put one point in memory. Ah, uh, there's something I was missing. Right. And we're good. Like, for uh, Iro in particular, you're gonna put points here. So this, uh, this gloves is literally just plus one to memory. So if you can get two initiative, it's already better. Alright, how do we do this? Literally, just swap. Drop one, two, drop three. As you enter the, just spam one. Fail the persuasion check if you want. So we hit once. Oh, beautiful. We hit twice. Farewell. My death Three times. Hit one K per each uh, necromancer and four point two for the actual quest. You need to break them one by one. If they all break at the same time, you don't get uh, the 420. This way you skip the fight. Well, not really skip, but you still get the experience for the fight without having to actually fight. Which is the same as skipping. Uh, another shield, what is your price? I heard something. This is the fourth or what? Oh, 
holding on to my points just a tiny bit more. We'll see what we get here, and that's basically the items I have, other than other than what Radeka drops. Which, by the way, Radeka is super resistant to to lightning. That's gonna be fun. There's a conveniently placed trap in there. You just put the zombie there. It's like a puzzle. Oh, he kind of dies. Alright, teleport, which by the way, I forgot to grab feathers. We'll go back there in a second. We'll skip that for a bit until we get nine. The air around us. Chain lightning. That's gonna be my five. Thirteen for this. Eighteen for the other one. I don't have st uh, eighteen strength. I, I can't reach that. And I got a helmet, which might be good. Oh, I actually do. Hold up. How convenient. Get something good out of this. Alright, so what do I want now? I wanted source, but I already took it. I want feathers uh, from here. If I wanted not to use chain lightning, I can go for uh, what is it called now? Bakimora. Just grab any necro book and craft it. Potentially blessed smoke screen. That's a bit excessive, I believe. This is only important because I need two teleports in the Lady Vengeance, and that's about it. Uh, we got uh, this big fight, Dragon, Radeka, these guys, these guys. I reckon I want to kill Radeka first. It's going to be rough though. this it looks strange mm, we can need invisibility because she's gonna be faster all right so one two oh double hit should just be one. So let me think of a plan for this.
I wanna keep the zombies alive so I can kill Rodeca with them. Not how I wanted this to start, but it'll work. This will have to be little by little. I can't stay like this. Well, we can probably kill this too now. Mm, maybe not. I don't have any tools for her. Spider legs could be useful here. Get a double turn, kind of. Lightning for this? Probably not. That was okay damage. Should have saved before this. Ah! 
Why am I not dodging? Yeah, I ask my character that question constantly. Why are you not dodging? That's a spell, you can't dodge spells. But that hits really, really hard. She used two attacks, so I'm gonna hope she just doesn't teleport me or something like that. back in a second. Are they still blinded when I'm in this? I imagine they are. Okay, that's not quite enough. that I think Oh, she's gonna teleport me Oh, that's fine I'll take it Oh, that's beautiful. Uh, let's do some damage, not too much.
I'd like this guy to come as well, but not happening it seems. to this one of those and that one just because still petrified let's see if this one reaches that'd be fantastic if he stays right there ah, not quite Blow the enemies. A lot of uh, lots of physical damage. I could try and break her armor, but it'd be tedious. Ah, uh, what we got? Uh, that's uh, maybe. I mean, it does give me free hydro, so I can free a ring. In fact, we might keep it, you know, for when we get immune enemies. Now let's identify all of this. If I were you, I'd stay close to Sagarin. Are you so once... eager to die, Seeker? You cannot. Stop. As you approach, Gratiana turns to you. Her moves are lighter now. Her voice is warmer, but still. Temp it would be. All right. So what am I working with? That's shit, shit, shit. Ah. Uh, okay. You would attack the Magister's direction. Shit. Warfare so Hydro. To die, Seeker? Uh, not entirely useless, but I you can't use it right now. Range, Toginasis. Not eh. without stronger weapons eh. than these. If I were you, I'd stay close to Sagarin once the fight begins. What am I begins. keeping? The two weeds on the head. Whatever part he takes will be the surest way you to victory. You would attack the Magister's directly. Are you so eager to die, Seeker? All right. You cannot stand against the Shriekers. Not without stronger weapons than these. We'll find them, or we'll find another way. You would attack the Magisters directly? Are you so eager to Having die, a Seeker? Of this. You cannot stand against the Shriekers. Not without stronger Alright, so uh, that's what I'm getting. Uh, more int. Uh, finally... Iro Iro, I guess. Yeah, we can go with this. Let me get the spider legs. If I were you, seems like I'd a good idea to, to have them. Once the fighting begins. Oh wait, Whatever it's at nine. Takes will be the surest way to victory. Oh, I thought it was at four. Never mind. I guess too powerful for for Joy. Against the 
Oh, I always do this shit. This is the wrong, we'll find them, or we'll find way. the wrong item. I meant to do it with this head. Oh, it's been cursed. Oh, and I can free the head slot. I guess we're using this. <laughs> Interesting. Gods, what is that? Whatever it is, it looks dangerous. Odd. My helmet seemed to stir just now. I could have sworn my helmet just jolted when no, I was just eating just people with the helmet, which is what I meant to do there. And I need uh, something. Something like peace of mind, or I will die immediately. Oh, my helmet! It's, it's getting tighter! As the source. Hell, it not as sweet. What is this? As always, there's a 10% chance that he crits me and insta kills me. We know that chance is higher for me. Oh. He tries, he tries. Alright, let's get him down there. Should have used shock first, but whatever. How much is this? 90? How do you feel about air? Feeling not very alive. Hmm, I wonder. For some reason there's a demon in that helmet, he comes out, tries to kill you, or alternatively instead of this fight you can just teleport him into the shrieker and he will instantly die. Let's go, uh, what does Alaskar have? Back. To initiative. You okay, a bit rucksack. late for this, but uh, still better than memory. I just can't use it right now. What does this give me? Wits. Yeah, I can do the dragon without peace of mind. Oh boy. <laughs> Probably get frost armor. Uh, ha ha. Ha ha ha. I know teleport is not gonna do anything. Grab me the totem. Medicine head is not gonna help. Something like this. 
Don't know how good it is, but... There's a trader here. You need pet pal to talk to her and convince her to go into a Matthias sanctuary. I can't be bothered. Oh. She's made of money, so am I. The dragon rakes the earth with ice. Okay. Quakes from the impact. How much to lightning? Twenty percent. That's uh problematic. Let's quick save. And see what we can do. Something called, by the way. Oh, that was not smart. He's immune to water. Okay. The quest one, you can give it to him and free him. No, I'm not doing that. I kind of need more damage. As much as possible. Come on. Come on. That's so unfair. I need something that gives me like a tiny bit more dodge. Nah, nothing at all. I just got super unlucky. 
Oh boy. Nothing interesting. Like I can take one hit, and that's about it. But he actually crit me, and then Dragonfall actually knocked me down. It's not sure that Dragonfall knocks down. I think it's like 80% or something like that. Probably... Yeah. Best I can do. Watch him use wild wing and hit me. I wonder. Wait, what? Well, wing, not wind. <laughs> that was a crit. Yeah, why wanna get everyone into this fight? Probably not. Probably not. Okay, what's my what's my plan here? What do I have? I reckon they wing eventually. Someone's bound to have knock on arrows.
How is it too far? Radicus conversations always end up badly. Oh boy, here we go. So how is this work now? Is he perma stunned or immune to wet? What? Okay. Good question, now what? Hmm. I am assuming he still gets shocked, right? Ah, I know what's happening. Okay, 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 okay. We're gonna do this one. Plus this one. I don't know if that's gonna work. Let me just do some defensive maneuvers. Okay, that kind of works. Oh, there it is. Ah, it's problematic, but I can get that. Ah, uh, not too often, though. I reckon that's it. Ah, he's got something called not perseverance. Is this how we wing? Just attack plus delay. Okay, that uh, that didn't work. I wanna put him to sleep because he will wake up. That's probably like a good rotation for this. I just don't see it.
probably let him get stunned himself. I wonder though. It's a bit dangerous. No, that's fine. Okay. I wonder how long he rode. Four of these. And now he's gone. Probably don't need them anymore. I'll keep them. What's my book? I didn't get a book. Oh, in fact. Uh, do I want this? This is a big maybe for Act 2. Not for now though. Yeah, you can get Hydro as well. You get more attacks. Not like Hydro is gonna help for the Dragon though, but... You know. Uh, let me get rid of... Frost Armor, Teleport. What am I missing? Medusa Head. Latin! Is that you? Where is everybody? Yeah, I don't really need peace of mind here. Well, I teleport this guy because uh, I need to pay him a bit. He's mad. Because there's a fight coming up. A young magister. Oh, I don't he sighs blindly beside the cart. I, I, I can't let you. This is not your. He continues to grope. Uh, we beat him. I have. He pulls a pair. Wait, do you hear that? Yeah, something like that. This range is pretty good though. 29. Okay. We can probably do something like this. This one's gonna get stunned, so target the others. Why'd you go for me? Chain lightning, we don't really have that. Is there any water? <laughs> That's all he can do. Tend to air. If I don't teleport the Magister before the fight, we all f six of us will be in the fight, as opposed to leaving these guys just there. Which is quite convenient. 
100%. We need to soften that one. Whoever goes first is gonna get stunned. So we probably put this one to sleep. Rang is high too. I mean Rang is super good with lightning, so. We got few things, nothing interesting. That's too far, I need to be closer. To our, hmm. This guy might come right away or might take like three turns of doing nothing. Kind of depends. Okay, you better attack this guy. This guy is still chilling, which is good for me. Oh, I thought he was standing on water. Interesting that this guy didn't get wet.
I'll have to do something like this. Time now. Here it comes. Oh, maybe not. Teleport. There's a trigger like in the Paladin Bridge and somewhere on the graveyard. So if you cross that part, Gareth uh, is not there with Jonathan. But you have to be, you have to be there before going east. Oh, he might be weak to air. Which I think he is. I'm gonna put him to sleep because I'm not sure if he's standing on water. Yeah, he is. doing the other Gareth quest. Uh, I think you get less experience. I'm not sure. I never actually compared. I know the other one is easy and you get lots of experience early which is what matters. So that's why I do. There's a couple more enemies here. Almost, but not quite. How does he feel about water? Mm, what happened to my damage? I feel like it was higher before. Uh, this should be enough. Oh no, I'm doing way more damage, but it's not that high. So who goes first? This guy. Now we played Pillars of Eternity? Not yet. Might do in the future. I don't know. Oh, 
Lots of things I want to do first. Ah, uh, you can fight this. I think it was playing the party where you just walk in there with four characters close together and still can salvage it somehow. Isn't right here. But yeah, walking into it ambushes is ambush. not the way to go in this game. Because you're gonna be in a bad position and you're gonna get destroyed. Alright, what else are we missing? I think that's it. Uh, stone done. Radek is dead. This part is done. We need nine. There's a guy alive here. A Saliskar is alive. Uh, but I think we can go to do the final fight. <laughs> I want to shock myself. Super fast. Uh, we are at 7 hours, almost done, so not particularly fast. Anywhere from 6 to 8 is normal. Depends on the build, basically. As you approach, turns to you. Who moves? It would be... Like Necromancer, for example, the whole playthrough is like 20, 21 hours. As opposed to usually 25 to 28. Theory. It's, it's so so powerful you don't have to you don't have to change anything you just kill everything as you go and it somehow works out I mean this is strictly better because it's more armor and HP not the best but what can you do you would attack the magisters directly are you so uh, we can send everyone now. I could use chain lightning if I wanted, but drop that. Praise be. Uh, so this is how it works for for this fight. Pretty much every time it'll be the same. Is this one resistant to lightning as well? No. We can kidnap the Geist and we'll fight one on one. So, how much is this? 15. That's gonna be a no for me. Oh, maybe I had this thing. Yeah, it's a lot of damage. Uh, 60 plus 20, we got 12, so it's probably a no. Just in case, like if I roll very low, it's problematic. He's gonna get stunned on his turn, so I'm just delaying. Uh, unless they have dodge, I kind of want to identify them just in case. If they have dodge and whatever else, it will be good. Ah. 
Your bag. Looking to add some ah, weight to your around. rucksack. Well, I have to try. So we got the Geist, now they're aggroed, so we can do this right there, because they are all together, three of them. We can get some rain if we want it, just so they take lightning damage on the way. Not much, just a tiny bit. going around. Interesting. He gets stunned. That's fine. We can do a tiny bit more damage here. Like a couple hits on Alexander. Could use Adrenaline if I wanted. Good damage. Uh, we're just gonna go invisible because I don't want to deal with the worm. For a solo player, or a solo character rather, there's a high chance that the worm will target you and just one shot you. So we just break some armors and now we hide. After Alexander's third turn, the worm spawns, and now we wait. Not resistant to lightning, huh? Obviously, on this fight, the Magisters have to win. <coughs> Ideally... You mean to knock down? Ideally, only the Magister Metamorph and the Marks Mormon survive, everyone else dies. <coughs> Good damage. I'm just chilling. What is that attack? <laughs> it's got so many targets and it attacks a barrel. I feel like Blinding Radiance is missing something to be actually good. Like, range is okay, damage is a bit meh, and blind is meh. It's just not good enough. I, I think I'm delaying next time. I'm doing some damage.
Worm should be dead next turn. Huh? Probably, uh, wait, okay, let me, more arrow, more int. I feel like I need high ground for this. Just enough. Alexander is fallen. The son of Lucian. What change do I make to make him Murderous. feel good? Make who? If you mean blind in radiance. I'm not sure. Make it last longer or Give it a tiny bit more damage, that kind of thing. I don't want to fight from here. Uh, let's go into this corner. My third source is pretty much more of every time. It's relatively easy to get there. Okay, you can see uh, this is what I did with the guys before. When this is electrified and they are standing there, you know when their turn starts, they're gonna be affected by the surface. If they're wet and they're gonna get shocked, it's gonna be a stun right away. So I can delay. Not only do I have a double turn, because I delayed, I can potentially get three turns in a row. This one, next one, and she's still stunned, I get another after. So I can just do auto attacks for a bit. Um, literally not worry about anything. This one is not gonna move. And by the time... It comes to my third turn. Water, I can electrify a gang and shock a gang, stun a gang. Pretty comfy. He's gonna steal or steal. I mean, it's hard and loot. Okay. Mm. I'm guessing she's resistant to everything, yeah. Just go there for a bit. Rain is much more valuable on enemies that have resistances because from 30, she's on tank. Yeah, she's gonna get a uh, stun right there. She's floating though, which is... I, I'm not gonna delay because she's floating she's not gonna take damage from that. I can potentially go down there and... 
Use shocking touch, but I've got chloroform. Alright, so what do we do now? Take so much damage from my lightning. I wonder. She she go ah uh, what she tell uh, I hey she you I come you'll have to have melody after you darling. <sighs> All right, we got nine. We haven't finished here. It's a couple more enemies, NPCs that have to die. So from here, um, right about there. Much faster than going all around. Let me get my new face. Well, as you see, we are the hands we have the specs laden with. Alright, so I got an item for making them. Oh. Something has changed. You Not thirsty, basically. And uh, now I'm well, changing now my face. The with the specs laden with I got another item. Change my face again. The well, you. And so and so and the well so. Is yeah, sometimes if you move your skill, you actually cancel your animation or your actual effect. The well you can get stuck. With a different face than you should have. Also, it is the way to get fame with an elf character and time warp and without uh, without having to use a mask. You can get it for free if you actually teleport during the transformation. It's a bug, by the way. Alright, what we got? Dodge is okay. Leadership, Warfare Scoundrel, Pyro, that's uh, maybe? Necro Warfare Summoning, okay, that's uh, maybe as well. Three Torch. Alright, so what did I get from there? Hydro 2, where am I getting Hydro from? Oh, helmet. Okay. I got dodge. I 
these belts are not very good. And I got... Oh, this one gives me the same as the chest. It doesn't really help me, I think. I'm gonna keep it in case I, I get something much better here. I kind of like the dodge here. This, uh, I can go to 10%. I got plenty of initiative. I have, I have two more levels before I actually have to fight anything. And my weapons don't give me anything. So I'll switch to this one. Get rid of uh, totems for now. Two necro is strictly better than this one. Plus summoning for free, that's Necron summoning. If I wanted to use uh, Vacuum Aura, I could now. Right, what else? Uh, this one. It's also a maybe. I kind of like the attacks. I could do this on my offhand and still have range attacks, although I only have one. I'm not sure if I want to do that. We'll see. Uh, let me get uh... okay once more check the kid oh well where's the oil check Nebora. She looks at you with wet eyes and manages a wink before returning to her work. Iro? Ah, uh, that's some maybe though, because it's just damage. Good to see. Uh, I already have Hydro, I believe. Yeah. Okay, that's. That will do for a bit. Maybe I'll change it as soon as I get to Driftgood, who knows? She looks at you and there's a wand there. And Isn't this poison? It's fire. It has to be lightning. Otherwise, I'd be using the this sword. Although I can put a lightning room in there. That's gonna fuck up my water. Nah, that's not. Finesse Huntsman. That's uh. Yeah, that's another maybe. Good to see. Get rid of this. Get rid of that. And we go say goodbye to Salskar. How does he feel about lightning? 23. Don't think I have enough damage for this. Me and the suffocation. Oh well. It's gonna use frost armor. It's gonna take a bit longer. That's fine, we can wait. No frost armor. You should have. Let me creep closer for this.
I could have checked for level 9 items, but not gonna do me any good at this point. Alright, we got everything. We've killed anyone that's worth killing. Nothing I have to bring, no death log, no chests or anything like that. So far in Fort Joy we don't need to switch to anything not lightning other than Radeka because I mean I could have done it but it's faster with the zombies because they just do so much damage when they explode and the dragon was a bit tedious but you know also this one doesn't go here this is nether swap let's go Malady god salty And that is Fort Joy with an Iron Mage. So close to escaping. God. So many have fallen. Grab the password for tomorrow. I remember this one. Grab some stuff. His name was Kirby. More money, I guess. His friend's sword couldn't save him. It would appear. And we're gonna wait on the mirror. But that's gonna be everything for today. Tomorrow. No, I'm not sure if I'll start as early tomorrow. And it'll be a long stream, I imagine. Like 10 plus hours for Act 2. Mm, right. Ah, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, I'll see you next time, probably tomorrow. Have a good one.